Coming hot, Joe. No, Joe don't scream no more. It's mm. coming hot. I don't yell no more. <laughs> I don't come in hot. When I do, it's for dramatic effect. Like, I'm not really irate. Like, I have to say these things. So, well, at least that's who I'm trying to be. <laughs> there we go. That sounds better. Mm -hmm. There we go. Intention. That's who Intention I'm trying everything. to be in my 42nd journey around the sun. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sounds I like good. that. Um, it's cracking. 500. 500. That's what's cracking. Congrats, Episode 500. It's here. That's dope. Thank you. You think somebody got more? Yeah, like, I mean, more. More. Yeah. now I'm talking about in the urban space. Probably not. No, right? No. I don't know. That's dope. I don't Congratulations. I don't know. If they do, I never heard of you, so you really don't. No, that's what I, yeah, that's what I mean. No, that's what I mean. Yo, that's ignorant. Yo, that's so fucked up. Yo, that is ignorant. That's real. That's what? real. That's real. That's real. That's real. It's true. If you got more, I ain't never heard of you, so don't count. If you got 500 in an urban space and don't nobody know who you are, don't count. I mean, it, it do count. Count. It counts. You got 25 rap albums. Don't nobody know you. Do you really I got still got 25, I still got 25 rap, 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 rap yeah, albums, yeah, yeah, yeah. though. I know it. And the second I catch one to pop, exactly. these oh, 25, all 25 is going to come out. Yeah, like Russ. That. You yeah. got it. Yeah. That makes sense. The tree fell. That. We wasn't there. We ain't here. It's yeah. cool. But until you get one to pop. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, but, oh, man. See, but that's what was steaming me. I didn't want to start here because I want to start with just happy thoughts. But that's really why I had to address them doofy podcast niggas. That's why. Um, because, no. <laughs> I get and I, I think I, I get what they trying to say. Somebody has to talk have, at the timeline. I don't know who they are. We'll get to it later. Uh, we ain't starting we, we with them. Right. We can't. Do I'm it. just saying. I felt like I had a responsibility in, po in podcast world. I agree. Mm. I wanted yeah. to. Yeah. I wanted to go listen some more to their shit, mm -hmm. so I could really. No, nah, you did yourself a favor. No, nah, I wanted to tear their ass up. Just dupes. No, nah, I wanted to tear their ass. But up. that's the problem with pod now. Like you got to be careful of dupes. Because niggas just went to Radio Shack. And it's not a problem. It's a great thing. No, it's, it's a great thing. thing. Uh -huh. It's a great thing, but any great thing has the potential to be bad. Like when you just let too many people in the club. Mm -hmm. When you let mm. too many people in the music business. True. When you let Welcome too... to everything in entertainment right yeah, now. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm not mad at it. Um, but damn, the doofy. You just got to be able to spot a doof. You got to be able to spot a doof. I was home just looking at doofs. Like, ugh. When did it get doofy? <laughs> See, I, uh, well, I'll save it for when we have We'll it. save it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, round of applause. It's our 500th episode. I like to say 500th episode. <laughs> and I bougie. keep telling these guys that I'm trying to find new ways to be bougie. Mm. You do tell, well, you got to fill the bucket it, hat. Man, so you got that ain't bucket. bougie. Yeah, that's bougie. That's, bougie. that's yeah, not bougie. Yeah, that's, 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 that's medium bougie. It's hip hop. I, I never seen EPMD wear no Fendi bucket, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Jay Z there, seen, yeah, Lacoste. But you've seen EPMD in a bucket. I know. You've seen Jay Z in a bucket. Not uh -huh. Fendi. Fendi is what makes it like ill, y'all. No, it makes it Those bougie. It bougie, yeah. Because somebody wrote five, put five letters on it. Yeah. I, don't, I don't. Yeah, Roma. You forgot the Roma. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Fair. that's bougie. All right. But I'm not mad Time at out. it. Uh, what makes it? What makes anything bougie? It's not very fancy, is I, I guess the yeah argument. the ability that the masses if can't that shit afford has some it. Fucking paisleys on that is not what bougie is. Nigga, bougie can't have nothing to do with price. I'm that, price that, and not today. If that shit was patent leather. I would, I would be, I'd be <laughs> Wait, hold up, for a that shit was patent hold leather. Up. He had it on here. I might have not showed up today. <laughs> I'd have left. Hold up for a minute, because he's taking his little poor righteous teacher routine <laughs> too far. <laughs> Ish. <Rock> is <laughs> yeah, you fucking pissing me off. Man. Yo, you when you look at some, when you look at somebody, you can say. Oh, that nigga's bougie without it having nothing to do with how much money he makes it looks and what he has on. No, just him. How he moving? How he acting? He yeah yeah. He liking all the expensive shit. That oh my god. Would y'all keep trying to insert the word expensive to me? Just calling somebody bougie, and I'm not true. I get what your point. That's is. all I'm I get. Bougie is a state of mind. Is what you're saying. No, bougie is. It's how you carry yourself, kind of like nah. and a even, little prudish. And even that word ain't from here. Where's that word from? What's Bourgeois. That? Yeah. You, French, bourgeois yeah. is the original word. You know, we no, give a nickname to everything. That ain't our shit. Bougie. <laughs> Yo, everything here, <laughs> everything here is not ours. But I'm yeah, not, exactly. I'm not starting with that either. Um, <laughs> but yeah, why you call me bougie? Because it's water that they're not paying me for, so I won't talk about it. 
But it's not no, it's not no, 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 playing no, no. You, you little Fiji game. It's not, dog. That's why I'm calling you. Not bougie. playing your little tiny. It's Fiji not. Game, it's not for the water that they're not paying you for. It's the fact that you came and shit it on Fiji. Fiji water yeah. for that water. <laughs> Send nigga to Central Pay one time. Now they want this the Dykeman hoes. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you now been, you, you been too making good. a living at Dykeman for the last thirty Fiji years. Fiji held you down for years. Now you too good for Fiji. Nigga uh, went to Dubai like, one time. Where that shit from? Europe. Never diss the Dykeman mamas. Called every one of them when they was trying to not let the blacks in. Oh, man. Like, hey, you see what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> they hate when I talk hey, about yo, that. Anyway. Um, but yeah, no. This shit is good. It's just good. It's a good one. It's, a it's good. One. It's decent. It's good. It's, this is not an ad. This is just good. Bring so when I from, find something that's good. Bring a water all the way from Europe. It's kind of crazy if you really man, stop and think about it. It's just decent. It ain't banging <laughs> like he's saying. It's banging to me. Maybe we oh, have okay. different cool. palettes. palettes. That's true. Yeah, like yours is a little bit more bougie than his for sure. <laughs> like I wouldn't have went another year in that truck. <laughs> like my my skin wouldn't have just sat like it would have bothered me. <laughs> like every time I honked the horn, I would have been like, oh, it would have fucking killed me. <laughs> anyway, I'm I'm kidding around. I'm joking around, of course. How y'all doing? Y'all good? Good. Everybody's good. Sure. Good man. Good. 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 Awesome. So I want to dedicate this episode to somebody very special out there. <laughs> I know it sounds like I'm joking, but I'm serious. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, girl. Oh, he was about to find Shorty then, boy. <laughs> Microphone check, one, two, what is this? JBP Gang Bike to Welcome to episode 500, as you can see by our fancy decor. Uh, All balloons. of the beautiful balloons. We love balloons. Our beautiful balloon arrangement that we have. Welcome to episode 500 of the Joe Budden Podcast. I am Joe Budden, your highly favored. Yeah. I wonder what number we'd be up to if we counted all the Patreons. Dog. Seven million. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, we'd be pretty high. Yeah. Um, I don't remember the intro. Just high. Hi. We're here. Just, just we here. We're here. We're here. Glad to be here through a snowstorm. I can't call it a snowstorm. It was a snowstorm. It, it was light. It, it wasn't light. light. Yeah, it, it wasn't, wasn't light. a storm, but it wasn't light. That shit is gone already. Listen, nah, they yeah, prepped. Light. They prepped. The trucks was around my way dumping salt every fucking where. They prepped. Check was, this out. That snow wasn't low. I shoveled this shit. It was a snowstorm, right? I still go out in this. Me too. But I ain't Ew. shovel. I ain't shovel. <laughs> <laughs> I will. Check your man. I will. <laughs> no, you don't drink no aquaponic. <laughs> that ain't, you still shoveling the snow. Still shoveling the snow, man. Stick to the Fiji's. Clean off that, a couple cars. That Nestle. The whole shit. That ain't I, even Fiji. That's Nestle. I yeah. left that snow sitting right on top of my car. No, I'd have fell. I'd have sued, too. Huh? I'd have Walking to your door. I, I definitely thought I it. I was like, yeah, it's a little lick right here. Oh, your, your driveway was a little... Yeah, yeah the walkway. You wanted them. Um, yes. You was going to slip and fall and sue. You don't think I've gone through enough? <laughs> <laughs> it's a new year. Wow. I might as well get some time. I ain't giving out shit, <laughs> God damn it. I ain't giving out I'm, a God I'm, damn I'm <laughs> <laughs> Like, hey, <laughs> 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 yo, I need me some spanky, yo. Oh. So listen, I had a, I, I want to dedicate this episode to somebody because I had a real uncomfortable conversation about maybe two weeks ago with somebody, and I was I was dead ass wrong in it, but I was stubborn and wrong in it. That's oh, weird. Shocker. Made, yeah, you really? <laughs> you don't say. not you, my nigga. No, you was wrong, oh, and, 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 stood and, stu and stood in you're wrong. Oh man, damn. You know, they scream out my failures, but whisper my accomplishments. <laughs> like, I can hear it. Yes, you guys. I was stubborn and wrong. Right? Were you loud, too? <laughs> I mean, I, I ain't a betting man. Well, I was texting. Uh -oh. You I was texting. Text, text loud. You was texting loud. I don't feel a voice, voice note in there loud. No. Nah. Or all just like the you frequency. All if, if you text too quickly, then that's loud. No. You, well, you all, can slam the text. You can slam the word You can all there. cap an you exclamation it, point. Yeah. Ice, yeah. you think I slam text? You might. You might I be know that, that little. I've never seen that, but. I don't even know what that is, but go ahead. You wouldn't. Go ahead. 
It's not for you. <laughs> it's not, pardon me. The green bubbles don't do that. <laughs> yeah. We can send like oh, confetti with our text, balloons. Put a little effect on it. Yeah. Slam it, make slam it shake the whole it. screen. Yeah, we could do we could send it invisible. <laughs> Look, An invisible this, text is this, this weird. Weird. Time out. <laughs> you say that time out, time out, time out. Y'all gonna really send a text and a phone shake? Yeah. Fuck out of here. Go ahead, Joe. You dedicate your- <laughs> I'm not doing this. No, gonna- you, you really yeah, you 70 serious? years old. Yeah, are you serious? We just broke you really down the whole metaverse years old. last week. Yes. And you don't even yes. know you can make a phone yes, shake. Yes. <laughs> I didn't know about the phone shaking. That's dope. <laughs> you know how I'm fucking them phones, them iPhones. But go ahead. I'm Carry dedicating on. this episode to Salehi, man. Salehi, listen, I'm gonna tell, and I'm gonna share a story, a quick story about how old I am too. I'm down with you. So Salehi makes the Salehi Crocs. I don't. Is that the name of those Crocs? Mm-hmm. The Salehi Crocs. Yes. Is that some arrogant shit? The name. <laughs> What's well, a collab? I, I it's can't. A, it's says a collab. the Joe Button Network <laughs> and the Joe Button. <laughs> <laughs> the Joe Button Podcast and the Joe Button Network. Oh, oh. Pff. <laughs> Yo, don't say. Oh, go ahead, though. Carry on, Salehi. Yeah, I, I see what you, you see. What he's on today? Go ahead, Salehi. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Come on, Jalehi. Come on. Yeah. Oh man. Wait, it's a collab. Yo, y'all so stupid, right? So, but those Crocs are super fire. So when we was having a conversation about them, mm-hmm. I guess I'm a, here. I think I must have called them like the special Crocs. Yeah. But you know how you just talk here in passing. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Right, so fast forward. He, he got he ain't like that shit. He got the new the new Soleil he's dropping. Mm. Niggas going crazy out there looking for the Soleil's. Girls, I know they hit. Yo, the Soleil's. I don't know what's going on. Right, mm. and he's kind enough to send me the the little friend and family uh, early access mm. so I could buy some Soleil's. Mm. But I'm old as shit, so I don't know that that's what's happening. <laughs> He sent I'm that tell link. y'all why this is pissing he me off. He sent that afterwards. link a night before, and I'm none the wiser. This nigga, like a doof. I just went to bed, so in the morning I figure it out. Ha ha! Too late. <laughs> They're sold out. But it's too late. They're gone, all of them. He's he's via text trying to show me how to go through this link, mm-hmm. even though I'm late. This is release day for him. That's insane. That is right. insane. But I appreciate it. Anyway, you've released some things before. Yeah, I try not to do that to people. Yeah, you can't do that to people. It's on like texting that. someone on like it's, day, it, day of a show. Yeah, it's or, or on a birthday. It's disgusting. It's just too much going on, right? So I, I miss out. He says, "Yo, don't worry about it. I'm gonna send you a pair. Just do me a favor. Don't call them the special, special Crocs, Crocs this time." <laughs> Now I had just posted them on my story, so I thought that's what he was talking about. Mm. But I ain't put no words, so I'm loud and wrong and str- Yo, dog, don't ever. I would never call them the special crops, yo. That's nasty. That's disgusting. Sounds clout chasey. Like it's not even something I would ever do. And this guy is just such a classy guy that he found a way to say, "No, you did, and you're wrong," but in a classy way. He was like. Yeah, no, you probably didn't even realize the name, name of the shoe. And, mm. and I was listening to the pod, and that's what you said. And then I listened, and I was like, oh, shit. He's right. I got to dedicate an episode <laughs> to this guy. <laughs> so, like, he's got to get an episode. Because that croc he sent them, and... It must be a good croc. No. No, nah, they niggas is. going crazy. This is not an you. ad either. That's a good croc. No, Damn. niggas going crazy over. No, How much you one. paid? Four fifty. Oh, that's a good price. How much is that? Well, they're eighty-five dollars well, if you find them, but you ain't gonna find them. You're not, you're, no, well, the way well, the, the way if you got four hundred. No, look. Yo, so way. why you ain't get everybody size so so he could bless the gang? Excuse me. <laughs> hey, you see how I treat my friends? <laughs> what's, what's wrong with you? Yo, what? you see how I treat my yo, friends? Yo, dog, that's what we doing today. We can come. <laughs> yo, I'm no, joking man. all day. I uh, know it's cool. And y'all, my friends, who I'm amazing to, should know I'm joking. But um. Damn, what was I about to say? What was I about to say? Special I'm sure that that can happen, Ish. Hello? I'm with you. And I ain't know that that was your, that was your shit. That's not my bag. I'm pl- that ain't your... That's not my thing. All right, so yeah, that was my... That was my... I just had apology. To I had to get it off my spirit. It was all my spirit, man. Mm-hmm. So I just had to get off my spirit. But well, that was good. And I need some more of them shoes. <laughs> <laughs> no, them shoes is That's fire. nice. That's January. I'll wear them shoes in the winter. One apology in January. That's dope. You might get one a month. 
<laughs> Is you really think I be needing to apologize to that many people? Honestly. Like, who's out there? Yo, anybody out there that's owed an apology from me? Finish. 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 Yo, who do y'all think I am, yo? I'm gonna tell you. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Nah, nah. <laughs> no, I'm not doing it. Now. Why, dog? I'm not well, doing go ahead. it. Now. Yeah, you're right. Anybody that's old an apology. Anybody that's old yeah. an apology from mm-hmm. me. Mm-hmm. Let me know, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so please, you, please do that. You gonna argue with them loudly yeah. about how you don't own one? Yeah, <laughs> how they yeah. wrong? Nah, nah. Yo, that's not yeah. even what I said. Yeah, they just send you the clip back. <laughs> this you? You good, fam? You got it. Go ahead. Move right along. Mm-hmm. Moving right along. Right along. All right, then move it, bitch. <laughs> Since you threw me off my train and, of thought. And today's music news. Hey, what y'all want to start with? Today's music <laughs> news. Weekend? Stop. Weekend you drop. Start there? Yo, a pin dropped on the ground. <laughs> you heard it? Yeah, I, I heard did. it. I did. I'd rather heard that pin drop. <laughs> or I heard the pin drop. Oh, shit. This nigga said I was. Listen, let me tell you what I heard. Because, you know, I'm a, I'm a huge Weekend fan. You me are. too. That you I, are. I, I, I rushed to I also huge, love the 80s. I'm a huge Weekend fan. So I woke up this morning. I was asleep last night. I woke up this morning, and the Dawn FM went straight to the iTunes store. Sure. And mm-hmm. started hitting some snippets. Mm. That's what I heard first. Mm. <laughs> it's 90 seconds. This is what I heard next. Hey. Actually, I'm lying. I started with this. I said, uh, you trying to get him hyped. Let's see what he's doing next. It's the uh, Stranger Things soundtrack. Damn. Uh, John Travolta. This is what I heard next. <laughs> Almost threw my coffee off the fucking back. <laughs> <laughs> Almost threw my coffee into the fucking river. He'll make money, though. It's not about... It's going to make money regardless. This is what I heard next. <laughs> this is what I heard next. <laughs> I like this one, though. Oh, this sound all right. I like Out of Time. I like Here We Go. Oh, and I love this. And that was it for me. I would play the rest, but... Did you did you have any cocaine? No. Oh. I feel like that might be part of, part that, of the problem. Like, that's, that's a prerequisite? It might be. It might be. When I was listening to it on the couch this morning at 11 a.m., I said, man, this, for some this would probably this would be, be better with some cocaine. I listened to that, and immediately I thought of that little rollout text that he posted uh, saying, let's just put it out and enjoy it with the people. And in my head, I was like, you sure? I don't know if you want to enjoy this with the people. The people be honest about shit like this. And I ain't like when I seen Chance go through that. Trying to experience something with the people. The people told him about his album. <laughs> they did. It hurt. No, they tell a homeboy too. Are they? Are the reviews unfavorable thus far? I haven't so seen far. many good reviews. Yeah, mm. they've been. This isn't the greatest, but I mean, I'd like to listen to it again. Same. Yeah, I'm, I'm no longer. I'm not going to kill him. I need to hear this at 2 a.m. I'm, I'm not at least with a, a couple, a couple drinks in the, on the system. First listen anymore. It's, it's kind of unfair, though. It is. I need to hear this with the baddies around. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Or, or in a club. Kind of. Mm-hmm. Amplify it. it might hit different club. I don't want to be in that. I don't want the right kind of club. This would work though. It might hit. I wouldn't be in that club if they got some little laser lights and shit. That's what I'm saying. I'm not going to be in and that some club. cocaine. There's some, <laughs> some girls in the bad line in the bathroom doing cocaine, yeah. powdering their noses. Um, we kind of tell artists to push the needle, and when they try to push it, but this is not pushing it. the needle though. He did this. That's the only thing for me. Better. Yeah. Yeah. He's done this better. Sure. Makes sense. That's the this is me. more so, to, to me, this is safe. Yeah, he's kind of been caught in the 80s loop for a couple exactly. of projects now. And I love 80s joints. What you gonna call it, Smack That Project? Tory? Yep. Yes. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Like, I ain't gonna, yo, so I ain't gonna lie to you, you really that's tried to do, if you, you really tried to shit? go back to the 80s? <laughs> right back to that. He, uh, he, he knocked that, like, he was better than Bruno and them. Yeah. He, that shit was crazy. And Bruno did, and them wasn't 80s. And right, didn't pay Madonna. What was it? <laughs> that was 70s. 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 Yeah, it was 70s. Bruno's last one, the 24 no, character shit was no, no, no. for sure. No, I'm sorry. I was talking about the shit with Anderson yeah, back no, in them. No. That was 70s. Yeah, that was, was 70s. 70s. But that Tory, he he hit a he hit a thousand on that shit. I think he took that 80s bar and set it really high. 
And like I might have enjoyed this album more had I not heard Tori's album. But this mm. is not even like... And I'm not trying to compare them, yeah, but yeah, yeah. it's that sound. I mean, you can yeah, compare you're, them. You're they're, comparing they're, them. If, yeah, if, you if, can, but I'm just saying, it's, it's, it's perfectly if two okay artists are making the, the same two. type of sound, yeah. even if The Weeknd did it first, Whatever. Tori came and jumped and lifted that bar. When you're when you're recreating something from the '80s or from any era, it's not about who did it first. Cause mad people did it first. Like. Yeah, correct. <laughs> True. But this is like not '80s black. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Like I can't think of another. It's not even '80s. It's not even '80s white, really. Like honestly, it sounds yeah, like that, it would have been on. Uh, I don't. 16 Candles or yeah, fucking yeah, yeah. It's like a uh, The Breakfast music. Club or something. Yeah, it sounds like, it sound like I was movie soundtrack said, movie. Um, like, I was yeah. joking when I said it sounded like Stranger Things, but it does sound like it soundtrack It sounds like soundtrack music. music. From the 80s. Yeah, from the white 80s sure. movies, that's what it sounds like. Yeah, I thought you hit that on the head with yeah. the Stranger music. Yeah. Like, that's what it sounds like to me. It don't really necessarily sound like 80s R&B music. It sounds like 80s soundtrack music. Yeah. Video game music. Like, yeah. you can see Tom mm-hmm. Cruise running with this shit playing. And, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. Definitely that, sounds like old video games. First, my problem, my problem with some of this remake the '80s stuff is that for the people that weren't there in the '80s, like they not really letting you know how popping the music was or, in the '80s. Now, that might be what works. Why it worked for? Them. Like he got a lot of fans that wasn't there for that shit. Most so, of his fans, were right? Most so, fans so to them, before. this might be a new sound. They don't know true. none of that '80s shit, and they're like, "Oh, this That's is true. fire." That is true. I ain't never heard nothing like this before. Well, they heard they yeah. I see what you mean. But, but you get what I'm saying, like yeah, especially ones that aren't as musically inclined. They, have, right. they only have a they only have a vague idea of right. what the '80s felt and sounded like, as it opposed was. to us that at least kind of grew up in it. They probably seen Back to the Future or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't do that. Don't do that. That's Damn. not fair. That's not fair. Why? I didn't do nothing but play a song. I can't play a song. <laughs> nothing from from there. I'm just saying, y'all said. Hey, it sounds like something that changed time and that they might be unfamiliar with. That's real hard. I just thought of his first shit. Oh, you ain't beating this. But just let it rock and, for and a minute, though. Go ahead. I'm going to tell you something this. about this. Go I'll ahead. Clear, clear the palette a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I Ooh, think so. Oh, Lord. She not a baddie if she didn't throw this on with you, too. She knew this one. She probably put you on to this one. Oh, my God. This is it. Yeah. Man, I gotta throw this back in the playlist. <laughs> I don't know why you took it out. <laughs> I, got new, I got a new phone, so I had to uh, recreate. Yeah, don't re- do that. I'm just saying. I would have never. That's taken the go-to this out. right there. You know it is. This is hard, yo. This is crazy. That whole project is hard. Money is the motive. <laughs> yeah, you know what song? Now, is, you know, okay. real, you know what song? It's funny to watch the girls, <laughs> the girls uh, dance doing the strip club. <laughs> she got a thing, but niggas with money. <laughs> You ever just watch the girls what? when that comes along? What song you say? She got a thing for niggas with money. You never heard that song? I don't be paying You know that song. I know the song. I, I don't be paying Yo. <laughs> nah, right. they don't, well, ahead, they ahead, don't really bop to that when I'm there. What I was saying about <laughs> The Weeknd and his fans is his rise to stardom came like two projects after this. A lot of them don't even know this sound. Like, they, 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 they missed this. This was an underground project. Yes, it kind of swept through and blew up, but his Rise to Stardom and his, his megastar, all of that shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. came two projects later. They don't know this. That's why when he did his whole Super Bowl medley, he played one record off of this. Mm-hmm. And everybody, all of us was like, nigga, I want to hear the whole House of Balloons. <laughs> Fuck all this other poppy, high, high, happy shit. Give me House of Balloons. And he did one record. That's kind of crazy. Yeah. But do you not think they would have went back? That nigga's a megastar. Not I'm sure always. The, I'm sure it's such those, a the, different sound, though. The, the like three I, EPs are platinum by now. Yeah, well, like yeah. That, yo, he's they, re-released them. Yeah, he all of the old ones. He's re, he just re-released um, Echoes of Silence like two weeks ago. Oh, right. But they go back. If I if I meet you at this sound here, and I fall in love with you as an artist at this sound here, I go back. None of that sounds like this. I might be like, all right, that was cool, but I like this. This is where I got introduced to you. This is what I grew to love. This that's a totally different sound. So a lot of them new fans might not fuck with this. I don't want to hear that dark shit. All his music now is bright and happy. Yeah. This shit was dark. Yeah. Slow, slow and dark. Yeah. They like I don't want to hear this shit. This druggy shit. No, cut this off. Go Who put blind and light back to on. Cut this off, yo. I'm telling Sickos. you, they. W- I could Who would see ever it. say to cut this I off? I could see it happening. The pop, the pop fans. Yeah, the pop fans. 
Not this one though. No, this no, is this poppy is poppy. Enough. Yeah, I'm about to say this pop. Play yeah. wicked games. They don't want to hear that. All right. Oh my god! This Shut is up. Ice. They don't want to hear that. I'm Shut the fuck up! If you came into the weekend at no. blinding lights and all of that shit, you don't want to hear this. This could be pop too, though. Listen to what too he's slow. saying. This is yeah. too. Yeah, they say that. Fam, do you know what I can't feel my face when I'm with you is about? I, I <laughs> know. listen to what he's saying. I listen great. to how he's saying. I left this my girl different. back home. We all did, buddy. <laughs> Hell yeah, we was out that night. We were we outside. <laughs> It is King Toxic, boy. All right, I'm not playing this no more. Come on, we try to have a healthy pod this year. <laughs> Get off with a full toxic. Yo, why thing? niggas be like that? I don't love her no more, but you'll never know that. <laughs> <laughs> that is it's sick. Crazy. Yo, niggas got to get better, yo. I agree. People. Niggas, niggas will never get better, man. Niggas are going to nig forever. I think some, some, nah, some nigg- chicks, chicks be in that same boat. Though. Nah, nah. <laughs> true. Look, the nigging is getting reversed. Yeah. They Nig- nigging now. D- niggas is the new bitches. <laughs> yo, I'm not lying. <laughs> they are, yo. The, ro- the roles is can, getting reversed. Can you expound for the people that may not know what you're talking about? Oh, we we cooking now. <laughs> nah, look. So <laughs> stumbled into all niggas is the, the new weekend, yeah. is the new bitches. Yeah, yeah. they are. Women These niggas more money really, than you niggas. Yeah. Women, women talking to you with they dick out now. Yeah, like, yo, they play them. Fifteen inch too. <laughs> they pulling it out. <laughs> Shut your ass up. <laughs> Sit your dumb ass down. Yeah. Well, a lot of women are wearing the pants in these households. No bullshit, nigga. I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, yo. Get in the kitchen. They out here. Get to work. They really are. Seriously. When no, I right. get home, you know, there better be. You right. Oh. There better be a dinner on the on the table. It's funny you say that, right? Because I was listening. I was listening to some women speak the other day, and they were men bashing. And they got into there how there's a double a double standard because men are able to just date date and fuck as many people as they want, and women are looked at as unladylike mm-hmm, if mm-hmm. that would happen. And I paused that. I stopped that shit as soon as I heard it. Hey, ah, wait a second. Every every girl that I know talks to mad dudes, multiple men. Want to sneak though? But if you ask them, yo, how many women do you know that only entertain one man? It's not very many today. Oh. It's That's not true. very many. That's true. So, so that thing, that all that traditional shit is over with. Man. Yeah, but it, no, to, to an extent, because like like it said though, they doing it like niggas. You'll see a nigga out with this one this day, and he got a, a, a stable. Women keep it a little lower because it's still a little. Can't even have a shit. staple no more. Who dudes niggas. or chicks? It's just tough now. It's harder. It's just mm-hmm. tough. Yo, I, which speaks to my point. Chicks out here with a stable of niggas. And it's easier for them. Mm-hmm. Chicks out here with a stable of niggas, bro. Girls out here making their own bread. I want to go casual. I ain't really looking for nothing right now. That's a nigga line. Right. <laughs> and they setting that from the That jump. is a nigga line. And you know what happened, too? <laughs> we really probably. Niggas catch feelings. Hell yeah. The niggas oh, the oh, new bitches. Man. Niggas catch oh, feelings. Man. And now he's sitting here mad because she out with the next nigga. Yo, word, you just you just in the movies, huh? <laughs> yo, <laughs> yo, her you, text messages. Yo, word, you just in the movies, huh? He's paragraphs. I like the bowl. Why you ain't ask me? <laughs> like, yo, these things is different. I'm telling you. Yeah, bro. you niggas that text the girl while she's on the date because you found out about the date is nuts. It's crazy. It's disgusting behavior. It is. For real. Yeah, go find something else. For real. You just gonna post the plates. I see his arm I see his arm Little little Daytona on huh Look Little Daytona on huh Oh you So you just had the game In them seats (laughs) Get dunked (laughs) But what do y'all do When y'all When y'all Like how do we fix this As as the male community Cause that shouldn't happen What shouldn't You gotta go find Some more women Fam, we are a fatherless society. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> niggas ain't got no fathers. Your father, your big brothers teach you how to move. These niggas is girl, bro. Yes. And then. <laughs> oh, man, I don't want no. Go ahead. I don't want no sauce. We here, man. We here. So, look, Let's go. All right, cool. Mm. So you learn from your fathers. You learn from your big brothers. Right. How to put, move. Uh huh. 
So if you don't have that or that's absent, who do you learn from? We can't even discuss the shit in an open forum without getting smacked on in society. So you just got more niggas growing up with single mothers learning how to be bitchier. These niggas is girls, dog. And if you say some masculine shit, you get looked at like you toxic. I'm with you, but I'm, something in there sounded toxic. <laughs> <laughs> what I say? I don't. I'm not intelligent enough to pinpoint it. Prove this point, man. Uh, something sounded. I didn't say one thing disrespectful to anybody, dog. It, we are a society that's not growing up. So I, I, I read a post. No, no, that's what you said. That was wrong. You can't say that. You can't say that. Niggas that are raised by their moms act more bitchy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying that. And, and so think I about mean, it in context. You don't have any masculinity around you. Even though that is the same message that Method Man gave to me on that walk we took. What'd he say? He said most men that grew up without fathers respond may respond to things emo- uh, in an emotional yeah. way that they mm-hmm. would not have if their dad was around. Bro. I don't think there's anything wrong with saying Shout that. Shout out to Meth. Shout out to Meth, too. That was his way. I remember that that day. I yeah, remember yeah. That. That was his but see, that go back to telling me I was emotional. <laughs> <laughs> but look, in that moment, what was he doing? He was big brothering you. Yes. In that yes. moment, yes, he, was he was the big brother that yes, was giving was. you some motherfucking OG. guidance. Yes. Yeah. Which I, is a I good was, thing. Bro, a great that's thing. what he's saying. They don't have that. But that's why I started this with how do we how do you help when you see when you see that? How do you help? Well, you don't see it's, it. It's hard. No, you see it. You niggas you, be sending triple no, and quadruple texts. I never know. I no, never you, know that. No, I never you know. know that you beating her phone. Well, yeah, I do know because that shit gonna stop shaking on my end table. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, the gangster shit is the girls be like, look at. this. I go over there. Right. Pick no, it up. Yeah. Yeah. girls be like, that's how you know. Look at this bitch ass nigga just uh-huh. sent me. Look, they'll tell. They telling. They will tell look on your ass. Shit. Look at this shit. Look, look at this nigga. nigga. And the nigga be in the public like, man, word is born, man, fuck. I want Yo, it. nigga, bros over hoes, nigga, fuck these. <laughs> and the nigga be behind closed door like, yo, word is born, why you do that to me? <laughs> yo, that is different. These niggas is different. I promise you, they are different. 100%. And the more money that the girls make, the better car. Nigga, you can't pull up on them no more. They pull. What's up, little nigga? What's <laughs> up, little nigga? You got your little five series. What's up, little nigga? Like, they pull up. What could you do now? Be funny. <laughs> and be handsome and charming, and, charming. Yeah. and punctual. And, 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 they don't know how to do and, none of that and, shit, and though. Have a good taste. And, 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 they don't and, know and, how to be charming. Vibes. And give them a little shake of the leg when they can't control it. That's what really that works. See, that's what really that does, uh, it helps. That, that leg shake can get them. That's what really separates us. Is, can is can the you leg execute? Shake. Yeah, yeah. Can you execute? And cars, they can't money, get to dinner, the leg shake. What y'all talking about? I think who could get. That leg to that fam. Yeah. They can't get oh, that far. Oh, it looked far. like a whole Y'all body it. convulsion. She going. <laughs> Y'all about yo? Are you all right? I gotta call an ambulance. My mom. <laughs> nah. Yeah, that's what separates yeah. people. Yeah. Don't, yo, they See, that's don't why get, people don't play with they me. They don't man. get that far though. Nah, nah they do. She'll have, a, she'll have a, 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 a light night and take it for a spin. Ball players are out of, out of town this, this night. A lot of times, yo, them niggas nah, can't you know what? close it, bro. Nah, it's they per- can't close it's persistent. it. I'm telling you. You got to be persistent. Like, But even today, look, look, being persistent today is damn near a charge. Being persistent you, today gets looked at like thirsty. And they exactly. will, and, and they're going to air your ass yeah, out. Yeah, they will tear your ass up. What you talking about, yeah, persistent? That's, right. That is kind of true. Yo, we just fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Look, I remember Ta-da! being one of our one of our homeboys, right? I remember it was in Pink Elephant in New York when Pink Elephant was open. Mm. And Let's that, talk about the eighties. Nah, Pink, <laughs> nah, nah, Pink Elephant was the shit. shit. Yo, so we in there, bad chick. We all know her. I was like, yo, I want that bitch, right? So he's like, man, fuck that, that bitch, that, that woman. <laughs> look, <laughs> no, look, the nigga says, man, man, she be fucking all them ball players. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck. Yo, ball players taking her out the club like Ken Griffey. And I told that nigga, fam, I don't hoop. I'm funny. I talk to her. Yo, you be on the phone like an hour. Yeah, yeah. nigga. <laughs> Putting the work in. Yes. yes. That, that's, yo, look, if I hooped and made seven million, that's part of my game. Right. I, I don't have that game. I, so got, I got another game. Conversation. Yes. Work funny. I <laughs> I, so you kind of got to separate the two. But to Ice's point today, conversation and persistence gets looked at like, you thirst bucket ass nigga. That's funny you say that too because the late the, the women were explaining to me that there's a such thing as the pass around trick. <laughs> the trick that just is running around just they passing them around the yeah. trick on everybody. Oh what? Yeah. They know that. Yeah. 
They know the password. They know that. Yeah. They put their homegirls mm-hmm. onto them. Yo, this yeah. nigga right here. Girl, it's you ain't the, even got to fuck him. Just act like oh, you yeah. like him. All right, now yeah. check it. It's the yeah, flip. We all knew the pass around chick. That was, you tell your man, yo, all you got to do is talk to her 10 minutes. You in. I don't know. I don't know her either. You never met her. I knew her. I said new. I didn't say no. Oh, I said new. I used to know her like comment. We all, <laughs> it all goes to the shit to being reversed. It all goes to shit flipping yeah, around. Now they crazy. passing around the nigga. It's the upside down. Aha, bitch, nah. I got a Birkin. You only got that blah, blah, blah. Yo, that's crazy. Nah, tell me if you passing me around, dog. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't pass me around. Stop tricking <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> well, get past it, nigga. No, nah, they don't pass me around. Okay. What's wrong with getting passed around? Like a blunt? Have you the trickster? Well, fam, if you out here tricking, then they say, girl, girl, girl. But how much is he tricking? Does it matter? Yeah. If they're passing you around, I don't give a fuck if you're spending $100. Bitch, be genuine when you take how my 100 the- <laughs> <laughs> How good is the starting five that you're getting passed around on? Oh, you know the funny part is before this pod started, Parks pulled Stop me outside. Stop saying that, Corey. And Parks pulled me outside and said, "Oh, there's so much to talk about." <laughs> <laughs> Yo, stop saying that. Corey said it don't matter when you got bread. Don't matter about what? If you're getting passed around. If that's what you want. No, don't pass me around. That's I, I have oh, feelings. whoa, stay here, stay here. No, no, I'm no. A man with pride, you don't do shit stay like here. that. That is part of the reason that new dudes are becoming the new bitches. Because these niggas with that money. Have made it cool to say it ain't tricking unless you, if you ain't got it. Or what the what it ain't they tricking saying? if you got it. That's say they it. saying. That is they saying. <laughs> They've been saying that, and it is no, still tricking. That we keep is trying a to part tell you, of the new bitchdom. It is still tricking. That's part of nah, the bitch. But, but tricking is dope when you can trick. <laughs> it is. But they're trying to. They, sorry, they, it's sorry, such a negative sorry, stigma bro, on it to them, so no. they'll say it's not tricking. That's their way of getting out of it. It ain't tricking if you got it. Hey, no, my nigga still is. Now nah, that's broke hate on that's trick niggas broke like. Nigga, rich niggas started saying that. Yeah, that's not broke hate. That's not broke hate. That's not broke hate. Rich that's niggas was the ones who now started saying it ain't tricking if so you got now it. Oh, you... we no, we all right, then we update the line in. It is tricking and deal so with what? it. Yeah, no. What are you gonna do with it? Go get you some money, nigga. Split the rent, man. <laughs> go get you some money. Yeah, it is tricking. Now go get you some money. So you toxic. <laughs> yo, you hey, are toxic. Nah, them niggas gotta work harder, yo. <laughs> I worked hard for it to be this easy. Oh, boy, you lucky. <laughs> boy, you lucky. Yo, fam, that's not true. Hey, Stop pushing shit. that message. What yo. to work harder? My no, dentist told me that. No, not the work harder message. We should all work harder. Stop pushing the message that it's cool to to be a trick. If he cool with being a trick, how am I going to tell him it's not cool for him? Because then you become the pass around and we diss girls when they start talking like that. If he is okay with being the pass around. If he wants to be a Spalding, he can be a Spalding. <laughs> <laughs> Let him live. <laughs> and if... Mm-hmm. Wayne said, I fucked the whole group. Baby, I'm a groupie. <laughs> Fam, if you paid to fuck all five of them, that you ain't get that off. But he fucked all five of them. Trick ass nigga. I'm not <laughs> listen. I'm, I ain't. I don't have a dog. If in I that fucked fight. all five of them either, off of my own if merit I wanted to fuck and all off five of my of them, own look, personality, look, look. that's one thing. That's if you. I paid y'all, nigga, that ain't dope to you. He might be like, look, I wanted to fuck all five of them. Mm-hmm. It took me nothing to fuck all five of them. That little money I gave it took him fifty k. It took fifty k, and I'm worth. 400 in or high, I'm over 100 mil mm-hmm. that 50k is nothing that's a hundred dollars yeah. so I still achieved my goal of fucking all five of them very easily and, and so am I and I'm not I'm not so knocking, to him he's I'm like I'm cool that. you right I'm not knocking that to him you can't sit around and beat on your chest though like you King Kong can you but, fuck all five of them <laughs> me? I'm just saying. And hey, do you have the 400 million in the bank because if I do I'm King if Kong if I have 400 million in the bank I'm fucking them for free but you don't. But you don't. I don't got four hundred million either. So but I'm asking you the no. same five that he's talking about. <laughs> if I had it, you're I'm little not. Kong. It is little Kong. <laughs> <laughs> you're the little spoon, nigga. I'm, like, I'm still beating whoa, on my whoa, chest. Whoa, 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 you're whoa. the little spoon. We're not bashing little spoon, though. No, little spoon is good. Don't do that. Yeah, yeah, we're not, not doing today. that. We're definitely not, not hey, doing yo, that. Hey, yo, fam. We're not doing that. Dog, do you get my what I'm trying to say? I do. Yeah, I get you what broke. You're trying to say. <laughs> yeah, I am. You're right. <laughs> and if I had it, I would not be spending. It's, it's, that's it's, a lie. Hold on, I yo, can't let you do that. Oh my I god, I can't that. believe. I can't. You my man. We're I can't. For it. No, let's go. Let's go. Let's, let's dance. Go let's do it. Ish. One. One. Are you going? I'm gonna go. Are you going? If I'm worth, give me a number. Ice. Throw me four hundred mil. No, no. I'm no, the no, prize, no, no. bitch. Pay me. 
I'm the prize. Pay me. Why are we giving Pay me. Yo, why are we giving him 400 million? 10 mil. 10 mil. 10 mil. Ten. Ten mil. Ten. 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 He said, I'm the prize. The Pay me. Damn, I can't be worth 400. You get the 10 first. <laughs> You'll get the 10 first. You're You'll right. get the 10 first. And, ten and you're going to be wilding at the 10. And I'm going to look and say, Oh, that 400 is going to be, that <laughs> gonna be, gonna be, gonna be treacherous. different. <laughs> Fam. Go ahead. You got 10. You the, you the prize. So? I think more men need to start feeling Ish. like I'm the prize. We I, don't. I agree with that. We if don't. don't. That's true. Yeah, we just, don't. No matter what. We got, get mad at these be broken. Men, and we get mad at these women when they start being on their entitlement shit, when they start being on their high horse shit. They should be on their high horse be. shit because niggas is out here running behind them like stolen cars. Fuck you talking about? Whoever ran behind the stolen car. Yo. yo, that don't feel good. Yeah, that one, that one wasn't it. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, dog, we, we, they should feel like that. Then. They should feel like that. We can't knock them no more for, for doing the shit that they doing if we sitting around uh, advocating for the tricksters. I never knock them. It's not. We do knock them. I We've knocked knock them, them on this podcast. Yes, we have. I have. And you, you, you wish your voice. <laughs> but that ain't knocking them for, uh, for feeling good about themselves, being confident and That's secure. not the same thing. And if niggas Stop. is going to track, I tell them thing. to go get it. Being confident and secure and feeling good about yourself is not is a totally different thing from feeling entitled to a man to have to speak to you. He has to pay you to have a conversation. It's two totally different things. I'm with you there. It's okay, two wait, totally different I, things. And I'm, that's I'm where not, we are. Now, I'm not just, cool with that part. Let's play. Now we, I we just went through that on my OnlyFans. Well, wait, actually, I got a, I got a question. Get him, Parks. I got a question. Parks ain't letting that shit ride. Parks, Parks, Parks is Parks. on team ish most 90%. Most of the time. Most of the time. Yes, go ahead. But I got a question. So if, if the girls are making all this money now, which they are, they tons. If if I'm a girl and I'm making 500 grand a year, mm-hmm. don't you think I would want the guy that has 10 million in the bank? Yes and no. I can answer you. Okay. Please do. If you make five hundred thousand dollars, and, and I ain't gonna hold you, you got to put the girls at more than five hundred grand. Yeah. Oh, but, but yeah. Whatever. No. Whatever if the, you make five hundred thousand dollars a year as a female, uh huh, as woman. a woman, pardon me, look at me, this, this, go ahead. politically correct <laughs> with them. If you make five hundred, <laughs> you make five hundred k. Look, you make. Right. Oh, yeah. Stop right. playing, man. Hey, you make five hundred k as a woman. Uh-huh. In my opinion, this is only my opinion. Mm-hmm. I, I think that now. The intangible shit and the intangible qualities that a man brings to the table mm. should be highlighted and they should be more important. Mm. Because you are already financially secure. You don't need a nigga for no financial support. Um, hold Provision on. is not necessarily all hold financial. So you think she hold should on, be a on. trick mommy? No. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not. I'm going to use an example. And, and this is public information that she herself has put out. Mary J. Blige. What about her? Mary said, I'm never dating a broke dude again. Gotcha. So, because of what I went through, mm-hmm. dealing with a broke dude, mm-hmm. I need somebody that's, so if Parks, to Parks' point, if I'm making 500, a million dollars a year, whatever the case may be, you have to be on my level. I'm not going, I'm not stooping down a level. Yes, the other shit matters, the intangible shit, but that matters too. That's not stooping down. We have to stop saying that. It's not stooping <laughs> it, it, down. It, That's only it one be, level. It, it could be stooping down, though. So, all right, now let me give you an example. You only stooping down financially. The nigga is fucking the shit out you. The nigga is teaching you shit. The nigga is making you laugh till your stomach hurt. The nigga is doing all of these other things. You're not perfect. teaching me too much yeah. if he's broke. That's not you, true. You guys eat That's the same snacks. True. That's not true. <laughs> That's far from true. It could be a nigga doing that. On the yeah, same yeah, financial yeah. level too, though, and she's and what they're saying is they'd rather go and try to find that. And the niggas that got all of those qualities on the same financial level, guess what else they doing? A, a, a lot of other women. Exactly. Like, you fucking, me. So no, that's what I'm saying. So you can't <laughs> well, shit come with the territory. Yeah, and, and that's my point. So I shout to Mary and whatever she had to endure in her situation. It may be unfortunate. If I broke up with Mary J. Blige, I don't. I'm not taking your bread. That's my manhood talking. I'm not taking your money. I can't be mad at him for what he did. I don't know what they did. Right. They said circumstances. I wouldn't do that. But women have been doing that to men since the fucking beginning of time. And women champion that shit. They do. So now if, if we're going to be on equality and equity and all Uh-oh. that other shit, what's good for good is a goose is good for the gander, no? I'm just saying, like, yo, fam, you can't. Listen, I'm not. Got my I'm up. not jumping. In, I'm, <laughs> I'm not. Up. I'm not jumping in because I'm rich. So I, <laughs> I don't know what you want me so to say. So you are a rich single. I'm, I'm look, having a blast cool. out here. You are a rich. <laughs> Tricking is great. I buy my friends shit. I buy Tricking my, my lady friends. I trick. No. I'm tricking. Cool. And I'm not knocking it. What I'm saying is, you the young, single, wealthy 
You ain't wealthy yet. You on your way. You young, single, rich, black man, decent looking guy, good education, good sense of humor, all of that shit. He dropped out of high school. I have a good education. You do have a good education. Your education don't got to be book education. Take that part. (laughs) Yo, the white man gonna stop trying to put us down. Next month is February. (laughs) Yeah, but my man had my back. My man had my back, though. My man had my back, though. Right? Get it out now. Dog, you the cream of the crop. And what is globally offered? Why the fuck is he the nigga that feel like he got to pay somebody for some fucking company? I don't think he does. Well, like see, I, I think that's where you're losing it at. He don't, yeah, don't have, have to. to do that. It don't have to. Is that what you think about the tricks? You feel like they think they have to? The uh, girls put them in a space where I'm not entertaining you unless you pay me. Now, if you are saying, look, I don't really feel like catching feelings. I'm going to pay you to leave. Cool. Because it's on your accord and on your rules. That's one thing. But to get a conversation out of Tasha, right? You got to pay for my conversation? Oh, no. oh that's no, no, insulting no, 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 to no, no, me. No, 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 no. I'm not, not talking about that tricking. That, no, we're not talking about that tricking. That's that. That's, 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 that's extreme different. tricking. Yeah, that's no, that, I don't even think that's tricking. Where the fuck is the line a, drawn? That's being a fucking idiot. That's somewhere. tricks with two T's, that's not one? Yeah. That's not even tricking. That's a capital T trick. That's something else. That's today. That's something else. That's today. I'm when at, we go to strip that's, club, that's freshman tricking. Yeah, that's that, I don't uh, even think well, that's tricking. I, I'm that's like something on else. Varsity tricking. I'm not. Why? Doing because that. your money longer than the freshmen's. Yeah, because no, because I'm one of the niggas. There's niggas out there ish that's saying, and I don't know how deep we need to get, but there's niggas out there that's saying that's calling a girl saying, "Yo, you and your homegirls, come over here. We gonna run over here right quick." Ah, uh, uh, uh. that's not him feeling pressured. That's he's he's used to a lifestyle. He affords himself. It's not tricking. You said that's not tricking. That's not oh. tricking. Oh, okay. That's, oh, so then wait. I enjoy being in your company. I'm about to go get something to eat. Y'all want to come eat? Let's go eat. I fuck with y'all. <clears throat> but at the end of the night- They call you, that chicken. They do. That I don't. Because you had lobster and butter sauce, you're not entitled to fuck me. That's not tricking. That's me hanging out with my friends. They just I was going to eat without the y'all. Female eat but what if they're not your friends, Ish? What if these are just women that you thought were so attractive the from the internet yeah. and want to run somewhere real quick? You are trying to get to know them. It's a date. Okay, so let's we say it's a date. The same thing. Like so, oh, okay. if you so, if I go so, out on so a date, by with Ish's a, definition. So wait, what is tricking? I'm I want to know what. I want to know what. Because I'm not spending now money. I'm confused. Trying to fuck or or thinking that I'm spending money on people that I feel like I can't fuck if I didn't. I'm not never. That's doing tricking. That. Okay, then I'm so not that's that. tricking. Yeah. I'm that, I, 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 I'm, me buying my friends some food ain't tricking. That's broke nigga no, shit. That, but because a funny. lot of broke niggas say, if yo, it, if you you tricking one way or the next, if yeah, you see, taking them out wrong. to eat and you going to the movies and you buying something to All eat, right, here's my that's tricking. Here's my that's not tricking. For you. Okay. Forget the friend. Forget the friend. What if you giver natural trick giver <laughs> wants to do this to one of the baddies who and you know what. <sighs> Why? Because <laughs> <birds. laughs> we are oh, really on back here. We hear birds. birds. Uh, oh my and god! You, and you happen to do? We're the birds. <laughs> we're the birds. We are the birds. birds. Big pelican. Yeah. Listen. Speak for yourself, fucking. <laughs> Foghorn, leghorn. Nah, no, I'm saying. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go Listen. Ahead. What if you uh, choose to be big trick giver to one of the baddies who just so happened to require that in her dating life? You don't know that. You don't know that she requires that, but she requires it. <sighs> How would you get but, to that level of giving? Just from the rip? No, I'm asking. I'm asking so I could get that's context tricky. before I reply, reply. That's tricky. If it's just from the rip. Well, from the rip, that's you tricky. could offer a trip. To a stranger. To a stranger? You are a fucking gopher. Yeah, yeah, y'all wild. I don't know what you're talking about. Y'all wild. That's the, yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. This is where you lose me. All right, so now we're now we going to take it to tripping. Now we're going to take it to trips. For me to go on a trip with I just a, asked you that and you said that would be end. me getting to know somebody. No, that's not what I'm saying. When I'm going on a trip with you to another place, my nigga's 24-7 you. Tr- going on a trip with somebody signifies if you like them or not. Because I can't go to work. I can't go to school. I'm with you 24-7. If I don't know you, I don't want to be around you 24-7 because I might want to throw you in that fucking water in six hours. I'm, I'm with you it. aggravating as a fuck. I don't know you. You have no I conversation. Don't yes. I don't know nothing about you. I don't You're know nothing about Dodo. you. You just a pretty bitch that I'm trying to entice to fuck me by spending ten thousand on a trip. You are a fucking trick. One hundred percent. That's tricking, bro. That's tricking. Okay, let me try to address some of this. <laughs> We're all, we are all over the place. We are. But that's fine. <laughs> Happy fifth hundredth episode. Ish. 
yes, I'm not going to pick a young lady that I've never met to go on a trip that I wouldn't have sex with if the opportunity presented itself. Indeed. Right? Mm-hmm. But when I pay for a trip as a super trick, it's not guaranteed that you're having sex. Now, for some niggas, the niggas that, that think you're talking about, they're not doing that if it ain't guaranteed. They're doing that to have sex. That's why I'm not going to refute anything that you're saying. But there is another demo where we just real niggas so we know what's going to happen when we <laughs> land. <laughs> and, and the sun is shining. And they got the little martini as soon as you get mm, off mimosas. the... Yeah, so, hey, as soon as you walk out just, the airport, the bar is in Cabo. Hey, let's drink here. Okay, drink over there. She drinking everywhere. By the time you get to the room, oh, it's the pool here. Like, it's not coercion. It's a beautiful scenery that you want to pop that pussy to. <laughs> It's not coercion. That's not coercion, no. Okay. Wait, that fam, if we'd saying that that's, that's coercion. coercion, dog, I didn't say no. by making the scene beautiful, no, <laughs> no, no, because there's niggas out there that's, that's coercing. So I don't want to do that. But yeah, I don't think that's tricking. And I think some people they play like that. Now you just not gonna know it till you rise up the ranks. Listen, you was that you was the best point guard in Jersey City. Mm -hmm. Then you had to go to the AAU over there. Mm -hmm. and and just as good as you. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean. You had to do something to separate So, yourself. to that, you say what? To which piece? Just the last piece about the difference in tricking out of necessity and just tricking because. <laughs> All right. So, I want to get to know this young lady. I find Do her. you ish? I'm that, asking. Oh, you're asking. I'm going. Oh. If I want to get to know this young lady. Mm -hmm. Right? I find her physically attractive. Sure. I want to get to know her, see where this potentially might go. Is Cabo. that no. yes or no? See, I'm, and no, I'm, I'm, no. I'm, no, I'm, 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 I'm getting the context. My so answer I can is no. You don't want to get to know her. My answer to that is no. Okay. You're so, asking me, I want to get to know anybody. I'm taking the truth. No, I'm saying. But the answer to that is no. Generally no. Not Joe Button, no. Yeah, Generally yeah, yeah, yeah. no. Yeah. So the dude don't really want to get to know her. Nah. He's tricking. Because now your intent is sexual. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You just added intent. What I'm saying Joe is. Joe said, yo, we going over there. We ain't necessarily going fuck. But if you don't want to get to know the girl, why the fuck do I want to be in another country with you for four days, it's, five days? It's, you know the answer to some of these questions you're asking. Yeah, fucking. No, company. And bring your friends. I got better company. I don't want to get to know you. You just said I don't want to get to know you. I, I have better company, too, and I couldn't think of somebody to go to the game with me the other day. I had to land on you. You think I wanted to walk in the game with you? I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> See what friends I'm, I'm just saying. Sometimes you you want to you just think of something cool Listen to do. Up. Hey, there's an escape room over there. You go through your friend list and mm -hmm. the women you know they out of town. Your friends is married. They doing what they doing. You land on. Hey, I just want some company when I go out. I may not want to so go you were, go further with you or get to know more about you. But I, hey, I we've been following that. each other for a few years. What's we've up? had a few conversations. Let's you look up. like a vibe. Let's just fly somewhere and see what it is. You can meet me there. We ain't even got to fly together. True. I don't necessarily think that's tricking. I'm not, I'm not rolling with that you, one. You've modified it a bit. But my whole thing was, and this is where Joe... The niggas that have to pay. No, this is where Joe loses to me. Mm -hmm. Because you said you don't want to get to know her. You lost right there to me. Because if I don't want to get to know you, there's no fucking way I want to be sleeping in the same bed with no stranger for four or five days in a row. Let me ask you this now. Shoot. Do you think she wants to get to know you? Absolutely. Oh, you are out no. your fucking cotton picking no. line. I'm no. done talking. Now y'all really lost. No, no, no. Wait. Done talking. Now y'all oh, really side, lost. My nigga. He's no, on no, your no. side. But no, <laughs> she don't want to get to know you. She's going for the... She don't. She's want. going for the what, Ice? Exactly. You, the, yeah. She's going for the money and the trip. And the trip. She's going for right? a nice time. I know. And a... a Joe, she's going, she going, she's going, she's going because ain't really she ain't got to pay for it. That's what she going. don't have to pay for. That's it. what she going for. Let's kill. Let's call it a buck. She and going because it's on and, another and, nigga dime. And guess what? And if the bag is big enough and the nugget shows her a nice enough time, she gonna go again. And oh, she cool. might want to get to know you then. Yeah. She want to come see the twelve thousand square foot jumpy. <laughs> you get you know what I'm saying? Like yep. yo, so now your your interest changes predicated on how much you money you really got. I hear these chicks talk. Yo, if you lead with money, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. If that's showing and what I, you got to offer, and, and, and I'm, I'm gonna take mad it. And I'm them. not mad at that. Be clear, I'm not mad at them. Get I'm these mad niggas. at the I niggas. tell all my female friends, get these niggas. I'm mad at the niggas. I'm not mad at the girls. I can't knock how the you The game is the game. And if that's how they wanna play it, win. go win. Please go win. I'm not mad at them at all. 
So you're saying you like the weekend album? <laughs> yeah, word. Because yeah. in the eighties, it wasn't even like that. <laughs> we will unpack yeah. some shit. Yeah, we got distracted Here. by the birds Damn. again, man. Yeah, this nigga. <sighs> Why do you love birds? He's saying this nigga, but you, oh start, you started that topic. <laughs> that was a great topic. If you're a bird, I'm a bird. <laughs> Say you're a bird. What Say else we got? Bird. What else? What else? What else is important? <clears throat> well, there was other new music, but I guess we kind of just said fuck that. Fam, who cares? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Who cares? Yeah. All right, fuck what it. What other new it. music? Y'all told me Chris Brown was dropping a single. I didn't see it. He didn't Ice. Drop. Ice what? That was on you. Next you week. promised us a Chris Brown. Oh, single. next week. Yeah. Oh, oh. It's next week. Single or album? Single. Gunner's album drop. I haven't listened to it yet. I ain't listened to it. I made it through four songs. What do you mean made it through? Like it was difficult. <laughs> I'm. I'm. Not, I listened. I'm not really a Gunner fan. So I know. Could you sing Gunner? Gunner. <laughs> yeah. The ER. Yeah. Uh-huh. We don't he like. Just, it's Gunner. He had a, a a diss record towards Freddie Gibbs. Not this, really. A, a diss bar. A, a, half a bar. Yeah. So that was a a lot of hype for nothing. It's all about that's what it's all about today. That's all they doing. Ugh. Hype. So everybody runs and listen. Run my numbers up. It's it, everything's a rollout. Mm. So why you got that? Hey, when ice is right. Why you got that smirk, yo? <laughs> I like Gunner, so I don't want to say nothing. Uh-oh. But I kind of it kind of felt a little rollouty when him and Chloe Bailey kept running around everywhere. And now he's got a song like dedicated to Chloe Bailey on the album. I already thought Chloe Bailey was a little cloudy, <laughs> or has been for the past few months. Mm. They've been looking for different ways to break her. I don't want it to seem like I'm trying to insult her. I'm not, but they've been trying to come up with creative ways to break her. Mm-hmm. So when y'all tell me that Gunna is dating her, dissing Freddie Gibbs for whatever, and I don't like the way, and if that, that's a diss. That wasn't much of a diss, no. It wasn't. Well, no, what happened was Gunna tweeted, when my album drops, it will be the biggest moment of Freddie Gibbs' career. So naturally, that's people- That's cloudy, too. It, it, is, it is. That's um, that's what I'm telling you. That's rollout. Right there. Because that's telling people, oh, I got to run and listen to the album to hear what he told. He got a whole disc record. What he doing? Oh, I ran to it for this? Yeah, uh-huh. I'm going to check the album out, because I like Gunna. Yeah, I'm not I just, just, I just I, didn't get around I, to it yet. I'm just I'm not the biggest gunner fan. So I know this wasn't for me. I wanted to listen to it to at least come and objectively talk to it, and I just couldn't make it through. So I have no take. That's all. Yeah, funny to me with the southern shit that you champion versus the southern shit that you do not. Because he's huge out there, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, he is. Seem like you don't like niggas if they're huge, Paul. Mm, no. I like Lil Baby. He's probably the biggest one out there right now. I like Thug. I like Future. These, I, I like the stars out there. It's just certain people that I don't like. Okay. That's all it is. Well, I'm going to listen to the Gun Album since our Southern representative. <laughs> well, y'all stop calling me. I'm you, every, are, you are our Southern representative, representative no, though. Not, you break it down man. for us. You are Apple representative, our Oculus representative. <laughs> right. Dukes of Hell. They've been blowing me the fuck up about this Oculus shit, man. A lot of people went out and bought an Oculus based on uh, the things that you guys t- uh, said last week. And I got a lot of emails saying, yo, dogs, how do I watch porn? <laughs> you see all, little I'm like, bam, it's uh, other shit. Yeah, 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 I know, but the porn. Did like, you see, what did you do see I do? the little clip of the dude humping the. Uh... Yeah, the virtual <laughs> shit. Yeah. 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 Who? There was a, a clip. Some, that some convention, the dude had the headset on and they gave him a doll and he was fucking the doll. It's going to be spooky. It's going to get weird. It's going to get very weird. Man. Did you see any of the uh, CES stuff? Yeah. They had some a lot of weird shit that's coming. Right. What, shit what, is getting what is spooky. That? CES is a, a, was it Consumer? Consumer Electronics, Electronics Summit. Yeah. It's like an expo. They do every year where they're showing the new shit they're going to be rolling out in terms of electronics. All the major companies usually... Go and show off they shit. Okay. Did BMWs that have uh, you, you can push change the, the color? The color changes. Yeah. I sent that to you. Oh, that's what that was from. Yeah, mm-hmm. got it. Yeah, yeah. That's had, crazy. Uh, it, that shows me how far behind uh, BMW is going to be in the future game. <laughs> that three Nigga, steering it, it, it wheels for the two, electric change cars. Change two colors, gray and white. Nigga, right. it changed with the push of a button. Let's let's see how ungrateful motherfuckers is. <laughs> the color of hey. the car changed. I know some hood niggas that's going to love that. Yeah, word. Oh, 
<laughs> so there's that part. Like saying, only, only, Yo, they're looking for a white yeah. car. Yeah, that's 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 better. <laughs> that's better than bulletproof to them. Word. What? Switch this shit to black. All right, now. I take it back. This nigga, yeah. The car yeah. changed colors I, with the push of a button. I, I, I wasn't so it was like, limited. Man. You're limited. Because I've seen some of the things that the future Mercedes is doing. So if that's what BMW is doing, then all right. Yeah, but that's concept. Good Same luck. Thing, Joe. Oh, they better they better have some more. <laughs> <laughs> the God. That, uh, wireless earphones or not? I'm sorry. Is it wireless? It's invisible earphones where it's like a uh, hologram. Yeah, it's like a hologram. Like you can sit and it just aims at your head and no one else can hear it, but you're not wearing anything on your head. Fuck that. They're oh. beaming the sound into my head. Correct. I'm cool, <laughs> but you, you not, say that now. And then, and then I say that now, but look, look at all the shit we put in our heads. Exactly. I was just about to say, nigga, fucking me up with said, the AirPods and all this other headset shit, the mm-hmm. Oculus shit. No, they said with the AirPods, the shit going, literally going through your brain. That's how they communicate. They said the left one communicate with the right yeah, and vice versa. True. So they communicate and they send in signals through your brain. Yep. Mm-hmm. They had, uh, uh, what are they called? Mind control earbuds. And that's why you wonder why these motherfuckers that out react to your facial cuckoo. expressions and shit. Like you'll be able to like do shit on your phone with your headphones without touching anything. Yeah. Yeah, we getting there. Yeah. It's getting ready to get spooky. Shit's scary. And this, oh this one's for you, Ish. They had a wearable, uh, Bio equipped tool belt needle oh. thing that goes on your arm and it's got like a very tiny needle and it can check. You, you trying to tell them I use skag? <laughs> <laughs> fuck is this going? No, we've been talking about chips for Stop a minute. Playing. Yo, yo, you trying to tell it's them the, the shoot is coming? It's yo, coming. Oh yeah. The only shit that got me was the new Samsung TV screen they showed. The, the shit that you can spin around and it's like a sixty-five inch. Curb up and down. This yeah, is these, these niggas' ceilings be seven feet. <laughs> Tops. <laughs> Go ahead. Now the shit is over the whole the whole ceiling. I ain't mad at it. <laughs> Go seven feet ceiling. Go ahead and break. The listen to this bougie. Hey, listen, that's, that's bougie, bougie bastard. <laughs> that's, that's bougie because I know this niggas got seven foot ceilings. Fam, that's bougie. Joe, All right, go ahead. Got seven foot ceilings. All right, eight. Eight. <laughs> eight is standard. Look, oh, look, no, I look, look. Speaking of bougie. Me. See, exactly. <laughs> look, look, Ish, I ain't tell you. Speaking of bougie, I go to hang a mirror for this nigga. He has steel beams. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, I don't have the regular beams like you broke niggas. My beams is steel. You got steel beams, too. All right, never mind. <laughs> All right. Anything new has steel beams. That's not true. Well, a, lot of, a, lot, a lot of new builds. Nah, right? it depends on where they building at. Aluminum. Ice didn't have the right equipment to hang on the steel beams. Like, what you thought was here, dog? <laughs> <laughs> you trying to put a nail through that yeah, shit? Yeah, <laughs> dropping Regular shit. sheetrock screws. Yo, Drop my cool. little mirror. It's cool. Damn, Ice, yeah, you, you couldn't fan. do it? It's me you're talking to. Don't do that. Where that mirror at right now, Joe? It's on the wall. All right. Mm. Beautiful, too. Mm. Took him a little extra. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Little, little depot little trip. Home de- little depot trip. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. To run over there. Yeah. Man. Self tap. Get them self. You know it. Let me get them, let me get them chill try. self taps. Look at you guys with the construction lingo. No, I'm just trying. <laughs> Pardon me. I don't know about the, the frequency, the boom bap. Uh, what y'all call it? Pre chorus. Yeah, all that. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Pardon me. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. What else we got? That was it for the CES. That was the CIS? it. I yeah, that, that was, was it. Kind of you know was, interesting yeah. little shit they're coming up with. Um and uh, E three, y'all. It's uh, Entertainment Expo, Electronics Entertainment Expo. It's like all the video game companies and shit. They have announced they're going digital this year. Okay. It's not going to be in person. It's a huge convention. I believe it's either LA or Vegas every year, and it's like a week long. And it's a big deal because everybody's been telling them, it's all yo, the video game go digital. Mm-hmm. Like, do online only. And they're they're using coronavirus to say, hey, look, let's try due to out. the pandemic, we're going to finally go digital. They're using so, that coronavirus mm-hmm. for a lot of things. I, yeah, that's <laughs> what I was getting at. To keep you at home and to keep you virtually doing everything. We it's prepping for, you. We it's don't got to force you. feed it to you when we can blame it on the It's Rona. prepping you, bro. This is where you're getting ready yeah. to be. Everything's yeah. going to be home. True. Get used to being home. You fuck We're gonna up. find a way for you to do everything from home. Cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not mad at that here. shit. Thanks. I want y'all to find out how we can pod. You gotta go to Atlantis. <laughs> I don't want to be in a virtual Atlantis. I'm going to Atlantis. I don't want to be in Starlet's well, virtual. Wait, no, 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 Atlantis. I'm going to. Hold up. We can go to the strip club with just the, the goggles on <laughs> in the crib. Mm-mm. It's not. Take me there. Yo, you know what's funny? I'm, I'm, at, I'm in Atlantis. Hit. I'm in Atlantis. Right. Oh, <laughs> this is just the time that we are now. She came out with the Oculus on. No, I'm in there early. I'm in there early, so it's nobody there. But when you're there early, you get to see the crowd as they come. You do. Mm-hmm. That's the best at part. around one fifteen, and I guess parties go here as like a party. 
Like they come mm-hmm. together. Deep. So at around 1.30, you start seeing crews of niggas come in, man. I seen a crew about 20 niggas come in, all wearing the fucking poo shiesty mask. Mm. First thing I thought to myself was, yo, man, it feel good to see all these black brothers being safe, man, protecting themselves from COVID. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you, oh, that's what you thought? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you telling them that? No, oh, you tell, I, no, didn't, no, no. I didn't tell them anything. No, you don't got to tell us that neither. Huh? Yeah, no. <laughs> you start yeah. looking where the exit's at, like... 20 niggas with Yo, the mask on. Yo, you know what's on. funny? It's funny y'all bitch. Crazy, that. nigga. I, somebody just uh, sent, nah, we sent gotta the go. post. People's stores are saying, yo, no shysties allowed. They called <laughs> it shysties. That particular mask. Yo, that mask, it's a, it's a Nike mask. The, that particular one that you're talking about. That's just $30. They're flipping them for $150 now. That's a good deal. And the fact that Poof. you know that, Ice. I, I follow all this shit, <laughs> I know. man. You follow the, the, the shystiness. I follow, the I follow all the shystiness. The shystiness. Like, like, that shit. fucking, for a $30 mask, niggas is flipping for one. I've seen them 150 I That's, can't, can't even hear this broke shit. <laughs> Fam, if I, could run, if I could run into the Rolex oh store with the Poo Shiesty on, I'd pay 150 <laughs> Every, Everything out you broke niggas mouth is, oh, they're flipping it for this now. <laughs> well, yeah, stay inside. You broke bed. <laughs> I don't need the fucking mask. <laughs> Happy birthday! Yo, Look how I've changed. <laughs> oh, man. And we only in January. Yo, nigga went from the Mary hat to the Fendi bucket, bucket. and just went up a level. <laughs> Imagine when we Look up in about August. <laughs> that nigga go ahead with a, a, a Javanchi chin strap. Nigga be in a fur in the summertime. Word. Fucking asshole. <laughs> what happened? What's up? No. And I got a scully in my bag right here just in case niggas thought it was something different. Oh, man. You should welcome me back. Yeah, you know I mean. That nigga told <laughs> Hey Nigga told Jay-Z He'll help him fall That's hard yo Cause that's what I'm bleep out. We can bounce if you wanna bounce mm-hmm. Ball if you wanna Oh you wanna ball till you fall I can help you That's funny yo uh-huh. Stop <laughs> You know now you know Now you know Ish ain't gonna find that dope Alright come on let's turn this off um, What was you talking about None. 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 <laughs> you being bougie. It's just going to be bougier in August. It's like That's the Wale. It's a pot about got, nothing. I man. got a trick for y'all. No, it's not. I'm going to pull my phone out <laughs> and be a professional. You want to uh, talk about <clears throat> what, what Jason Derulo did? <clears throat> <laughs> Jim Jones, maybe? No, wait. Go Yay. back to Jason Derulo, please. Did y'all see that? He chased the fan or something. They he beat him, somebody up. They called him Usher. He called him Usher. And so he started boobopping him. <laughs> Is that really why he did that? Yeah. Allegedly. The dude, you can hear the dude say, yo, Usher, you know yo, Usher. You know we go off blogs now. Yeah. I don't care. If it's on the internet, it's true. Facts. That's the rule. Close enough. I heard the dude say, yo, Usher, yo, Usher. And then he just turned on his ass. You can't really get mad at someone calling you a, a legend. Can't put your hands on somebody else's <laughs> kids. <laughs> Fuck is you talk about? You won't call me somebody. You call me Usher. I'm not mad at that. Yeah, no, nah, I'll take it. You call me Usher, I'll be like, yeah, fuck it. Now, if it was Usher and you say you're Jason Derulo, I might understand that a little different. But Ice. That's not a shot. Wow, yeah, yo. It's, a, it's not a shot. No. Yo. He is also very yo, successful. Wow, nigga. It's Jason not about Derulo success. Is, this is Usher yeah, we you, talking you about. You think you could take Jason Derulo. I don't know if you could. He a little ripped up. Yeah. You want to fight, you want to tussle. I'm not fighting no more. I don't fight no more. The, the nigga, this nigga Ice is different, bro. I can see it the other way around. If I'm Usher, Bam, I'm Usher. You call Usher Usher. He's Usher. You should call people by their names. Right, yeah. True. But you know why I like him doing that? <laughs> Restoring the feeling? Well, yeah, but no. Sometimes, as an entertainer, you be having a horrible day, yo. <laughs> You're not entitled to that. You be having a, the I worst day in the world. You're not entitled I'm, to that. He's right, though. Death in the family, your dog people don't died. Know. Fucking people Anything. catch you on the wrong day and it's on. Just mm-hmm. something going on and here go a nigga. <laughs> Yo, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I was dying to take my frustration out on somebody. The way he jumped on him, you could tell he was frustrated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. It, it and was more Jason than... Derulo be the happiest camper in the world, man. I'm rolling with him. I flashed back to a a Twitter exchange I had with Schoolboy Q. And that's exactly what he said. He was like, yo, I was having a bad day. I seen this nigga's tweet and I went the fuck off. You don't know what people, you don't know what people dealing with. Oh yeah, I look for a bad tweet to go off on. 
Well, used well, to. no, that's <laughs> the, <laughs> used to in my, back in my block days. <laughs> but no, that happens though. Like you don't know somebody having a bad day. Or niggas don't. They don't even look at niggas like they're human. You're right. Facts. Like I can only imagine, and that's why I, sometimes I I'll be a little reserved when we start talking about people because them niggas is human. Like you can only imagine the shit that Kim K and them get. Like the mega megas. You can only imagine the shit that they see about... Like, that shit be hurtful sometimes, my nigga. Damn. And people Rick. feel like, yo, you're a celebrity, so you signed up for it. And I don't think that. Like, if I'm a single or I'm an entertainer, nigga, I'm, I you signed up to entertain <laughs> people. Right? I signed up to entertain people. I didn't sign up to be your fucking punching bag and to have you say all mean shit about me and my family and my kids and my mom and my this and my that. That's not what I signed up for. True. All that being but said. But it comes with the, like... Unfortunately. Unfortunately, it comes to with... To the it. trolls, it comes with the territory. Yeah. And that's disgusting. Until the trolls get punched in the face. There you go. But then when you punch them, they do the white people, uh, what they call that shit? Lawsuit. No. Passive aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> Passive aggressive shit. No, no, they call it lawsuit, bro. <laughs> no, you punch just, a nigga, you paying. Yeah. No, they, they start being a victim. Watch it. Then you're paying. Yeah. Flag got punched in the face and paid, and Ross had to pay 300000 He sued him. Oh, that's it. He sued him? Yeah. I don't know if being called Usher is a punching bag, though. If you have it, you don't. But if you, if I'm having the worst day ever. You can't ever, tell the other person. You can't tell nobody how to react to disrespect. Yeah. That's not disrespect. It is disrespect. I'm not fucking Usher. What <laughs> <laughs> the fuck are you talking about? So, Ice, if somebody saw you and you might resemble that person to them and they said, hey, Yo, he, Davis, don't hey like, he don't look fuck like he don't look like Usher. That's a grand. I mean, the dude might have just said, I know who that is, but I fucked the name up. Right? So, if somebody saw yeah. you and, and they knew you, so called you Nick Cannon. My mistake. I'll take that. That don't Can't warrant them man. getting hit. Nah, that's the man. Damn, they decided to try to say you ain't. <laughs> I take that one. Yo, the candy, yo. <laughs> now you know dude was trying to be funny calling the mushroom. Yeah. You don't know that. We don't know that. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, and if he was, I'm not saying I he shouldn't have got him? beat up. No. Yeah, he shouldn't like, have got fuck. beat up. No, you can't. But y'all don't need me to come on here on episode five hundred and say, hey, True. don't beat people up. Like, what are we, like, what are so, we talking about here? We can move on. <laughs> No, let's laugh about it some more, though. <laughs> Yo, did you see the niggas um, cracking on Fab? Fabian's bougie shit like you. Fab oh, goes to work out with Mano and Jim. I've been seeing these. Looking like, uh, yo, he looks so fancy, yo. They was tearing his ass up. He bougie like you. No, he's much bougie. <laughs> Fab is way He is, is, he way is a thousand percent more bougie. They but was like, yo, my nigga, it's early in the morning. This what you got the on? <laughs> Yeah, if we got to get back on our hood shit, I think I could. Like, if I, I'm not pulling up to the gym in the Carolina blue. Yo, that nigga, look at <laughs> new sneakers, crispies. That nigga just like, yo, too shiesty on. Stop, yo, stop. And then went there and did legs. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> da- da- <laughs> Davies bench pressing mad shit. Jim Jones doing the Pulled prettiest, all prettiest all, pull you know, up you ever Jim, seen. Yeah, Jim and he walk up. over to the little leg press thing and Fab is there. With two, I'm like, when, I wanted to look at the plates. I, I made, I made a bed. <laughs> you only had a couple of That nigga only had about two, three plates on there. I'm like, yo, what are you doing, dog? I know you can extend a little bit more than that. <laughs> yo, not if you're not man. trying to fuck up the sweat, though. I ain't yeah. gonna lie, though. When I, yo, when I saw that, around, baby. Yeah, I think it's all about the money. drip. When yeah. I saw that, I wanted to hit Jim and say, yo, I'm coming. I, I'm coming. I gotta see this in person. Yeah. <laughs> but then if I come, they're gonna try they to gonna make me work roast out. Your yeah. No. 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 They go. Yo. Yo. Get on it. Yeah. Yeah. But I think throw these plates on here, nigga. But I think I could work out with anybody since I worked out with uh, uh my felon trainer. Fam, I you see the shit Jim be doing? Bro, you can't work out with Jim. You can't work out with Jim. Them niggas really work like Jim and them work yeah, out. Not I see Jim do a dip with one you're foot, not with one leg. What I'm saying. So let me clarify. I'm not saying I could go and do the same workout as them. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm saying I could go and work out there mm-hmm. while they're present. That's what I'm saying. Do you think your endurance is long enough to work out as long as they work out? I wouldn't be working out as long as them niggas work oh, out. I ain't trying. Dave East is on TV and Jim Jones. Jim Jones might be on TV, actually. No, Jim. But Jim, Jim is been working active, out active, for a man. long time. And Jim is like, fighting. he ain't new oh, to this. Well. <laughs> <laughs> Let me not do that. He's not new to this. Jim is probably preparing for a fight that I'm not preparing for. <laughs> <laughs> Jim always preparing for the fight, though. If you look like he is, yo, he gets it in. That well, that's really why I, I 
retired from fighting. It's the prep that goes into it. No, nigga, that endurance. You're going to get Word. this nigga this hard 37 seconds, and then I'm going to grab the shit out you and, and tell the niggas to break it up. <laughs> but Fab has to relax. Yeah. Yeah, I'm so not going to tell him. That was fancy. That was fancy. He I got, liked it, but it was fancy. He got a choice. It was early, too. You could tell from his voice, like, yo, stop, yo. Like, chill, I'm sleepy still. Yeah, but then I kind of felt him. Because if I know that I'm with... Mayno and just niggas that's gonna pull a phone out and try to have some jokes while we working out. Then I'm gonna be, be fly. I'm still be fly. I'm gonna be fly. It's a good point. I, mean, I didn't know that y'all was jokey jokey like this with the cameras. I thought this was a low thing, but it's not. I'm gonna be fly. And on the flip side, this is probably going on year 23. I don't think we've ever seen Fab not try to be that. The kids have a blast with it because they just probably seeing him and all this shit. But this nigga been doing the same yes. shit. Yes. Mm-hmm. yes. Yes, yes. He put a paper towel on his head. What are we talking about? <laughs> and had other niggas doing it. Yeah. Nig- I remember niggas was running around fucking up the bounty. <laughs> it's Elizabeth niggas. It's true. It wasn't just Elizabeth niggas. Jersey City? It was happening. No, Newark niggas wasn't putting no paper yeah, towel on his head. Yeah, no, it was. Why do you always think Newark niggas is better than everybody else? Because we are. But go ahead. I'm just going to say I s- You not from Newark, <laughs> yo. <laughs> Yo, why do you keep... I'm sick of this Jersey bullshit y'all be on in here. God damn. Yo, he's so oh, stupid, shit, man. Yo, uh, do y'all want to talk about Eric Adams at all or no? That, that, that little was, press conference bro. shit. We don't let's, have to if go. you don't want nah, to. Oh, no, you should, no, look at his face. Nah, I ain't, say, I ain't, oh. I ain't even really... We shit it on everybody that's been getting us through the pandemic. <laughs> You can't do that, I don't think. I don't like politics, yo. Is I That's me neither. I'm, so I'm, I'm not having a political talk. Faith, yeah. I'm having just a common courtesy, be nice and kind to people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't get on TV and call people that you need yeah. low skill workers. No, but you He can't go to Dunkin' Donuts again. <laughs> yo, and then you he tried to get some special cream in that coffee. Yeah, they got something for Wait, you. Wait, as if low skill workers wasn't bad enough, he started going through the profession. He started naming yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. them. Reeling yeah. them off. I think that. Didn't he shit on Cooks? Like, Cooks is not really a low skill. It might not too. be a. Uh, uh, no, they make money, and that's a skill. It's a skill like a motherfucker. It's a motherfucking what? skill. Um, Nigga, McDonald's is a skill, too. Let you get a, uh, the fries that don't taste like the fries. Word. <laughs> I need my fries hot, <laughs> crispy, salty, perfect Close. amount of salt. And Close. low skill implies that somebody doesn't have a degree, that they're not educated, that they don't have another skill. Sometimes, sometimes niggas just trying to get by. Right. Yeah, niggas. Exp- and and he see this is the part that pissed me off about that because New York, you, New York is one City, of the most, most expensive city. Niggas there need four or five sources in. of income no, to maintain out here. What the fuck are you is, talking they about? They may have the quote unquote. I'm not using that term that he used. I'm just using it because mm. he used it. They may have the most "quote unquote" low skill workers by his standard uh-huh. in the country. It might. Who are you to call it, it low skill, nigga? New York doesn't move and rotate without those people. The restaurants? No, <laughs> the world. Yeah. Fuck the restaurants, yeah, yeah. nigga. The subways, the yeah. streets, the yeah. all of that. Yeah, they don't. Yeah. They don't yeah. move without yeah. garbage. People. Then you shouldn't call them low skill. I, exactly. I'm, I'm agreeing with there's, you. There's got to be a better term. At yes. Least. And you being a political person, you should have had enough coof. And understanding to know that you were gonna insult the wild shit is there Wait. was a term you know what they called them before essential workers word no because essential workers no. goes no yes they do- did doctors no. and nurses are essential it, workers fam that so, was so, part so, of it so, so is the grocery store so exactly they not, tried all that shit when they said yo only yeah. essential workers the motherfucking garbage He's truck right. drivers the disagreeing. fucking grocery store people I, y'all was essential at his that time. context for what Eric Adams yeah. was talking about wasn't talking about essential workers he was talking about people that make less money from mm. Like jobs that don't require educations and degree formal educations uh-huh. and degrees and such. Right. He wasn't talking about essential workers. So a doctor, a surgeon, a lawyer are essential workers, but they have formal education. He was talking about people that did lower level jobs. And what I'm saying is the people that did them lower level jobs were also classified as essential workers when they first did that closure and said only essential workers can go can can go out. I just. Sus- it's no, good. I it's agree good. with him, but what Eric Adams was so talking about. shit on them. Wasn't that. I'm, he shouldn't shit on nobody. Exactly. The shoe shine niggas was not allowed to go to work, guys. Fam, they were, I'm not talking about the shoe shine niggas, though. I'm just saying. I'm just saying there are there professions are some pe- that. There's some overlap. There was some that were called essential workers that he still shitted on. And now you're calling them low level. Some of them. And you know how many nurses got fired? <laughs> niggas that were saving people's lives last year got fired. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. I seen somebody tweet. So y'all had to us the CDC. Up. I don't want to get into vaccine talking about that shit. But I see. I saw somebody tweet just yesterday. I tested positive for COVID, but due to the CDC guidelines, I can now go back to work in five days. In five days, but someone who because I'm vaccinated, but someone who was never vaccinated and never tested positive lost their job. That's fucking nuts. But go ahead. Look at my face. I don't want no sauce. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I just don't want no problems, dog. I don't want no problems. Oh, y'all think I'm the segwayer, huh? No, 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 no. no, no. no. I see what's going on. No, I no. see what's happening. I, I do like that to- New York brought back uh, to go drinks, though, because that was the lit part of the pandemic. Really? Hell yeah. You can get drinks to go. They tried to stop it again, but now it's back. It's kind of ill. So no, that means you can't get Ill. locked up on the street with your white cup, huh? That means you can't lock, get locked up on the street with your cup. Correct. And you can just order to go. You can. I'm just, I yeah, what I'm saying, if I if I go with it, you can't now lock yeah, me up because I'm, I'm out. Yeah, with I'm it. Well, I think if you're drinking no, on the street, you might still. Be, yeah, I think it's still. A thing you can't if drink, drink on the street. Oh, so you're supposed to just get the drink and go into your car and go home. Go somewhere. Yeah. Not drink in the car. I said to your car and go home. Yes. Got you. Yes. I like that though. I was enjoying ordering a margarita with my tacos. I see why they stopped it. Eric Adams. Yeah, hell yeah. Eric, Eric, Eric Adams said, "Yo, I, I used to be one too." <laughs> <laughs> he said that. Shit, just think yo. he. <laughs> I don't want to defend him, y'all. I don't want to, but I think we know what he meant, yo. No, but they see. This is why I have a problem. I can't even give you that. I don't want to. Got people that write this shit. I for can't you to go I say. can't give him that because I. That's was, why I can't. I give wasn't you that. sure if he was talking to me or not. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, you know how many niggas just sit on the couch and talk and get to talking in the mic? <laughs> I was like, hey, hey, buddy. Yeah, so I don't know. I just think you shouldn't call people that. Yeah, no, you shouldn't. Nah, you just should. don't have a little bit more respect. I mean, I think he's new to politics, though, right? He's going to learn pretty quick. Oh, oh they're they they, they, they learning learn him now. Him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're going to learn him. They're learning him right now. They are definitely going to do that, especially the constituents that you pandered to to get elected. I'm one yeah. of y'all. Mm-hmm. One of y'all. One of y'all. Now I'm shitting on y'all. I don't know who he pandered to to get elected. Oh, I do. <laughs> he was out there. Stupid ass fans told me I was pandering last podcast about my uncle murder. I saw that. Yeah, I saw that too. Oh, I'm not. Oh, I'm not surprised man, that they said this that. Is so stupid, yo. It's so stupid. I'm not saying they're right, but I'm not surprised. <laughs> I don't agree. With I'm that. used to. And it. then when I defended black women, niggas told me I was pandering too. I hate when these niggas learn a word. Mm-hmm. That's y'all fault. I though. cannot stand when they learn mm-hmm. a word or fake learn a word. Mm. Yeah, they woke. They gonna so run it into woke. the ground. Are you so woke? Yeah, they. I mean, you guys just yo. You gotta come. And I, shut I mean, the I, fuck I, up. I, I, I try not that. to do that because today, I guess, with all of this cloudy metaverse, all this bullshit going on, there is really no way to know someone's true feelings. So I try to have some grace with that. Mm-hmm. But it's just, it's hard. It's it's difficult. Like I wish I'd have started potting like four and, years ago. And I don't have the strength to explain to people. No, I was really uncomfortable when I heard the line. Me, that's not to somebody else's my agenda. Audience, my yeah. audience is not LGBTQ plus, and it's not predominantly women. If I wanted to come in here and really just. Get ignorant. I think I probably could. You could. Yeah. And it would probably work. And it probably work. <laughs> yeah. Like what's most of y'all are doing. Some of y'all are doing nasty, nasty, disgusting heathens. But I wouldn't do that. Yeah, that line just made me uncomfortable. No, it was not because he dissed me in the song. He didn't diss you. He didn't diss you. But I'm just going on. Because he said your because name said in the song. The you know, a rapper say another rapper, another person's name, it's a diss. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. He didn't diss you, though. I text Freddie Gibbs this morning tell him all the beef you think he got is imaginary. He knows that. He don't know it. He no, I think he know knows that. that. He I, don't I, I don't definitely think so. Think he does no. feel like the world. He got assaulted he like... in a restaurant. That's not imaginary beef. Allegedly. 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 Yeah, but he feels like the world is against him. Most rappers do. When you're in that, yeah, but after after an event or something where the whole community kind of takes focus on you, mm-hmm. you could start to feel like that. Is that what happened, though? I wouldn't know. I, mean, I ain't been following the shit. No, you... Like, the gunner shit is nasty. The whole, whatever he's doing, the back and forth with Griselda, that shit is nasty. Now, let me ask you a question. I don't speak about the gym shit, because I don't know about it. I wasn't there. No, I'm going to ask you a question. I don't know him. But someone who doesn't have an album or release date right now, 
It's been too much attention. Or, you know how I think But has he, he antagonized that? He's antagonized yes. Why? And, and like you just said, Joe, someone without a release date or something. So let me generate some buzz. Let me get my name, get some traction out here. I'm going to keep entertaining all this bullshit. Yo, there's no pamphlet on how to respond to some of this stuff. And not many of us. What if you're the and initiator? Not many, and not many of y'all. What if you're the initiator? There's still no pamphlet on it. You shouldn't be the initiator. But if you are... So well, the world right. not against you if oftentimes you're the initiator. Two things can be true. Uh, no. No, they can't. Why you not? can't Because you can't say... And this ain't even toward him. This toward anybody. Yo, you can't claim yourself the victim when oftentimes you're the assailant. You're not the victim. You Sorry. can't say the world is against you if you out here sh- pushing niggas' buttons. Yeah, but if I push one nigga's button... No pun. What about four or five if or I six? Pu- he didn't push one nigga's button. If, oh, I, we push, taking if, this off I, push, if I push five niggas buttons, pause, Okay. and 300 niggas respond, I can still feel like the world's against me. I can still feel like, whoa, there's too much focus on me. There's too much attention. Too many people responding to me. It's my comments everywhere. It's my fucking, fucking it's everywhere. Well, that's, that's what I comes, feel like. That's that. what comes with jumping out doing that I disagree. cloudy shit. Or when you start generalizing. I'm not painting him to have done any cloudy shit. You start, Damn, you start generalizing. You said every New York rapper, you New York Fuck, rappers. Scr- so when you Let's group New York that. rappers together, Stop nigga, that. now you got you got exactly. but you, you right. could potentially get heat from every New York rapper. Did he say every? I don't think he, he said, said you every. New he York said you rappers. New York, you New York rappers. But he was talking to Uncle Murder. And that's the point. So say Uncle Murder. And uh, Griselda. Say Griselda, say Jim, say whoever. Somebody else, probably. So what I'm just saying is this. And again, I don't have a horse in a race. I'm t- generally speaking that if I say all Baltimore niggas, you Baltimore niggas, or you Cleveland niggas, or you L.A. niggas, mm. guess what's going to happen? L.A. niggas going to have something the to say. The L.A. niggas and the Baltimore niggas and the Cleveland niggas got something to say. I'm not saying that he hasn't played a role in... That's all I was saying. I'm not saying That's that. all I was saying. My right. thing is, I'm going back before that. I'm not even talking about that. I know a lot of y'all hate academics. I love him for what he do. But Who hate academics? No, not y'all. I'm talking about people. Them. People out there. People hate yeah. academics. I love Act for what he does. And I love for him the way he did it. It's but my, anyway... my little man, man. He's made a lot of strides, too. Of course. Know. And and against the rules. That's why of, I like it. A lot it. of these niggas could learn something from That's that. why that's I like topic it. He didn't, I didn't play by none of y'all niggas' rules, and all y'all got to deal with me. I love that. And y'all niggas call me, call me corny. Yeah, y'all, y'all, and y'all yeah. niggas shitted yeah. on me and Y'all tried to stop me, me and now you I can't. Wasn't a street I'm nigga, bigger than all of you niggas. And I got I love more money than yeah, all of you. Act, act like the girl that was ugly in high school that got bad yeah. later. <laughs> and you got to deal with her. For good reason, though. And you got to deal with her. For good reason. For and, good but, but the girl in high school that was shitted on. No, the corny nigga that was in high school, he was corny, he was in his books, mm. he was getting his grades, and now I'm a surgeon, and mm-hmm. now I, I gained mm-hmm. 30 pounds, and I'm in the gym every day, and I look like heaven to you bitches, and I don't want to talk to y'all now. Ladies. Yep. Ladies. <laughs> I don't want to talk to we y'all We get them now. there. We get them there, Joe. You get what I'm saying? Like, I don't yo, know if we are. We got no, 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 we, <laughs> no, we got them. We, we got them. We got them. I don't know if I, if I have faith in this experiment. A <laughs> couple months. We're going to put the bitch jar here. <laughs> I've been. I, I'm he won't. One. He won't put the bitch nope, jar. I'm you gonna lose some money too. Y- yeah, you are. You. You. Who? You, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> Shoot. He gonna lose more. I don't ahead. say it more than you. We're yeah. not comparing. You gonna have a nice contribution, is what I'm saying. I'm listening. I'm raising my hand for the audience. That can't see. They. They called on Can you. I go. Uh huh. Y'all are saying that because of how I loosely use that word. Mm-hmm. You're basing that wrong. You have to base it on how you think I would use that word if a bitch jar was right there. <laughs> Ditto, <laughs> Ditto, nigga. I wouldn't wait a minute. Sure you I, I, don't, I don't think he Joe can don't help like it. Joe don't like to lose. So I, don't think, I don't think he can help it. Joe don't like to lose. I think He's if gonna there's go out concentrated of effort from it. me, then I could not say that word. I could say it like Anderson Pop. Like me. It. I don't say it. I don't, a concentrated, have to say, I don't that say the word. When I use it, I would pay. Yeah. Like I would pay ahead of time to use it. Like, yeah, me too. I want to. I want to get my. But point you, up. nigga, <laughs> we can bring one in next. Yeah, week. That shit fly off. We gonna bring one in next week. We gonna bring one in. Oh, next week. See, yeah. see, one of them. We could put something there right now. Go we get a could. cup. Go get one. <laughs> Go get a cup. Pass me a cup. Pass me a cup. <laughs> it's easy. Now we I got one. I got one. What are we doing? A dollar, two dollars, five dollars. Never mind. Buck, buck. A dollar for every bitch. There it is. When it start? Now. Now. All right. Wait for real. It's easy. Did y'all bring singles? Let's do it. 
Bro, we gonna keep, we yeah. gonna keep track. I keep some singles. Look, <laughs> don't get this guy. <laughs> I think I'm like, got it. Yeah, you better not have no singles. I got a couple. Singles. Oh, all right. <laughs> I got a couple from the strip. Yeah, yeah, I no, I ain't bring my bag. I was just gonna say he ain't got the bag. I bring my bag. And I want to shout out the ladies, man. Boy, do I understand. I never used to understand it. You know how much shit you lose transferring things from bag to bag. <laughs> no. Listen to this bad. <laughs> you hear this? <laughs> you are ah, a bad court. one. You a bad, yeah. I, I, I mean, see you. I saw you. Yeah. You was getting ready to put one in I there was, right there. Yeah. That's I've lost you. mad shit tra- trying to transfer things. That's, that's, like, that's lip, some bougie shit. Glass. Oh, yeah, you, you lost, lost your lip glass. <laughs> that's some bougie shit, bro. I'm going to keep it a buck with you just to say that. Damn, listen to your Transferring song. from bag to bag, I lost mad shit. That's nothing bougie. No, that, no, no. Why cool. is that bougie? Never mind. Because the average man does not transfer bags, Joseph. Yo, every week y'all try to shame me for, like, what the average man is. You I'm just like, said I'm trying to find ways to be more I'm bougie. I'm not giving a fuck what the net <laughs> niggas doing. <laughs> I didn't tell you about my experience, Trent, losing shit, being clumsy. See, that's transferring how, from bag that's how to bag. Eric Adams got caught up, man. Mm-hmm. Be careful. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you, you, you Joe Adams. Nah, I, I'm never going. I would never. <laughs> nah, that's mm-hmm. disgusting. Come on, man. Let's talk about these two doofs. I'm not very hip, so we were supposed it, to t- it, enlighten me. We were supposed, we were supposed to, talk, to transition. We were supposed off to talk about it earlier, yeah. but that's cool. I didn't want to bring light to that bullshit, and I, I kind of already addressed it the way I needed to on Instagram. But it was eating me up inside. Mm-hmm. That's what was happening. I was home after the pod. I seen a clip like I normally do. I ignored it, put it to the side, mm-hmm. and I seen another clip. Yeah, it wasn't funny, and I was getting angry. It wasn't, funny. but I put it to the side. Then I saw another clip. I got angry, and I put it to the side. I said. I don't venture out in this doof land. I know that the doofs exist, but no, and I'm I know cool. that they are purposely trying to gain attention by doing, as you to take your word, doof shit. But were they sending shots at you, or it was just no? They were sending shots general at black doof women. Shit. No, oh. they were saying they won't date black women. Black women are off limits. Like we don't date black women. Like they was going calling them night, darkies and darkies, night riders. Night riders. Jesus, we don't do the night riders. Just saying shit like that. The fuck? It, it's more. I, I ain't really want to delve into it. I wanted to see them a couple more times so I could quote some of their shit. Mm. These niggas is clowns. Clown. You are a clown. You are a clown. super clown though. In but super, mind. super, super like, clown. You and you really clout chasing. They you saw what somebody else did with their opinions and Kevin you, Samuels. you thought that because uh, he got popular to, doing that, okay, okay. but he's do not that. doing what y'all doing. It. But they're right? not doing what he's he not doing what y'all doing. That's the problem. Kevin lot, Samuels I'll, I'll, is fifty okay. something years old, right? I'm tossing you guys. He's fifty something years old. Mm. No matter what you think about what he's saying, he's he's attempting to have a factual conversation. Yeah. One and be he's, fact based. He's just bad delivery. And yeah, horrible delivery. Horrible mm-hmm. delivery. And he ain't trying to demean. He can be demeaning. He's not trying what I think to demean. We spoke to him, mm-hmm. and I talked to him behind the scenes. And my difference in Kevin Samuels is, I think that Kevin Samuels is trying to inform and be informative to show people how we can bring together a black community. Okay. Right? That's what I think his objective is from talking to him behind the scenes. Mm-hmm. Like, yo, we've lost a black marriage. We've lost this. We've lost that. And these are the reasons why we're losing it. And then me telling you sometimes why we losing it, you might get offended. We're going to get into an engagement and he's going to be ignorant. Mm. But his big fan base is chicks. Most of his fan base no, is his women. No, his fan base is women. It's women. It women is. base. He got to be like an 80%. And people are like, yo, he saved my marriage. He this, he that. I appreciate him so much. Mm. These... Niggas is doing something totally different. They just looking for attention by putting down black people. Is it attempting to be comedy? No, these niggas are serious. Oh. And they insulting. Like, yo, they called the black women night riders, my nigga. We don't do night riders. They had a whole bunch of little uh, monikers if, that they were throwing out. If that's an attempt to be funny, it's not. Right. No, I know. No, they got episodes. What now. it is is... The dudes, One of these dudes... Go ahead, guys. The dudes are sitting there... Trying to generate clout, click, 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 clicks, click. clicks. Mm-hmm. You know, there's people out here chasing the numbers. Mm-hmm. Whatever I could do to get people talking about me mm-hmm. is a win. A lot of times it's, I, I want all of y'all to hate me. Right. So I'm going to say the most hateful shit How ever. How is Stern esque? Weird, yeah. But even what they don't realize is there's a method to that. They're not doing it. The you correct have, way. You gotta have content. Yeah, you have because to, exactly. Even you if can't I hate just you run for out two and weeks, say shit. Yeah. Like, I just want to offend. Yeah, 
I just want if if I can get enough people offended. Everybody's going to talk about me. Sure, there sure, is, sure, sure. We watch these brands do it all the time. You think H&M putting that coolest monkey in the jungle shit wasn't... Nobody looked at that and said, yo, you shouldn't do that. So there's peop- There's business in offense. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So people are realizing if I can get an entire group riled up, I can get some business out of this. But it's going to be short-lived if you can't present that, them with other content. That, and that's the part that... That's where they find right, out. So and consequent... And not... Hold on. And... Somebody might fuck you up. I'm not even trying to be funny. Like, they deserve right. an ass whooping. I'm going to keep it a buck with you. Like, I, I'm, I'm going to put it on myself. I've played the let's who who can we offend game 10 years ago. Mm-hmm. Done it. That used to be your shit. Grew up, realized, damn. Like, I've had conversations with people that said, yo, I know you my nigga. I know you don't think that way. But your words hurt me. Mm-hmm. I didn't even... I'm like, dog, you know I'm joking. Yeah, but that's not a joke. This is shit that I live and I go through. Mm-hmm. Yeah. True. And I'm like, oh, shit. That like, is true. Just because I'm thinking I'm joking. That's true. Y'all don't know I'm joking. Mm-hmm. I'm hurting people. That's true. Big facts. So it's like, damn, you can't do that. You, you, you got to learn how to not. Or you got to really let niggas know I'm playing. Like, we'll sit up here and call somebody brokeys. Right. Nah, them two niggas can't play. No, they that's can't. Not playing, that's though. not playing that's with not them. That's not playing. That's no, I'm saying, I'm saying, like, dog, if you sitting around them and you hear them talking, you might want to punch one of them in their face, or you might punch them. Like that's how See, offensive that's, that's it where was. I can get, and that that's the one. It was offensive right there. Like it was that, really offensive. That's where I get mad at Ak a little bit, and this is the only me thing because I've only ever seen these two dupes because my man was there. It's the only reason I even know well, these Ak two. Was on their show? Yeah, I've never, Ak, I've never seen them before. Ak that. has been on their show. Ak has done some things with them before. I almost thought that was Ak Studio at one point, and these two dudes was there, and it was like, all right, who's these two niggas? You don't know these niggas. Well, I think that would be the main knock against Ak is putting light on people that maybe shouldn't have light on them. <sighs> it's like if we went. To I a, wouldn't know these two dudes if we went to a KKK platform. No, not us. Parks. You went to a KKK platform because you're white. Oh, I thought you meant to fight. No. <laughs> <laughs> like that. Give me, I was a go. <laughs> Niggas would be disappointed in you. Hmm. So that's what you're saying? Like, because you know what their message is. So. Well, no, I, no, no. Because I never, I have never known what their message Prior was. To. I'm saying I wouldn't know that these gentlemen exist. If it weren't me, not personally. See that? Oh, go ahead. Because I'm going to tell you, that's my, that's, that was my problem with you, Royce, and a bunch of other people I seen even posting what y'all posted. You got to bring it. To, you got to be community. I get it. Got to be gotta community. Be, I got to be community that, at that but point. But what you're doing the first is what they was, want um, you to do. But that's the goal. But I, we're I denouncing get, it as black yeah, men. I, I understand. Wait, 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 that, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, but, but yeah, but I don't subscribe to their plan working. So they want you to do it for other reasons. I don't think if you spread this message that their plan will work. So I don't subscribe to that. If y'all want to become popular from this. I'm going to help you. And then you deal with what comes with that. And your popularity going to be negative popularity. You deal with what comes with that. But let me tell you what happened, Ice, because I'm no dummy. I'm well aware that I'm the wrong messenger. (laughs) I wouldn't say that, but go ahead. Well, people will. People People will. will. Like, I'm aware that people will say, right message, wrong messenger, not him, and then that followed by everything from my fucking history. So when I saw the four clips that disturbed me, I didn't say anything, but they really, really disturbed no, I me. Saw, mm-hmm. I saw two of them, and it was bad. I'm not a black woman. <laughs> At all. As a man. No, yeah. But some people made the pandering yeah, thing is going around. I'm not a woman. I was speaking as a man. I don't think a man would talk like that in front of me. Like I would look at a nigga if he started talking like that yeah, in front I, of me. We got a we got a man issue. Yeah, we might have a problem. Oh boy, right? So listen, and I don't really love the Asian uh, doll. Like I don't, I'm not a yeah. fan of hers. Yeah. How she handled that situation with so much class and mm-hmm. poise, while this nigga, while this nigga who I don't know to be black. He don't look black. He don't sound black. I think they and when he, one of them asked he, him, hey, he, are you black? He said, uh, my mom is from somewhere, wherever the I fuck he said. I think he's Sudanese. I think he Whatever Sudanese. he said told me he didn't identify as black. True. Right. True. But yet, you talking black culture, you got black people coming to your house, and I don't give a fuck if it's your house. I don't care where you taping at. 
You have black people coming there. And this is what you're doing. No, no, no. That's not all right. He did that. He did. He was saying some of that shit around white women. I think it's even more reason to get Mary Fismas because you saying you don't identify as black. So if you don't identify as black, shut your fucking mouth. Mm hmm. He That's said, even more reason. He said that sitting across from his black his host, homeboy, his homeboy, birthed by a black woman. Mm -hmm. He said, "Yo, we don't do the night riders." Oh no, no, no. He's saying more shit. I can't. Like I wanted I ain't to gonna play it. No, no, no. I wanted to watch some more of them. I wanted to watch some more, so I would have more shit in my uh, brain. So what, I'm glad I. So what happened was right. I'm, I'm, I'm letting it rock. But aside from Royce, I seen it. Uh, only 19 keys. Uh, Shabazz. It was, I followed it was a, it was 19 a few keys. people. Yeah. yeah. I didn't see enough people. Got it. I didn't see. I was sitting back because I'm not the messenger and I wanted to wait. But that's. But I didn't see enough people. I saw women outraged. Right. I, I didn't, didn't see, see enough, enough men, men mm. outraged. I'm rolling and with you. speaking up for. And women. I think you, like, like I saw that. Two I mean, look, can't do I it, saw dog. that and uh -uh. wanted to say something. But then I'm like, I always think if a person wants to get a reaction. For whatever reason. And you give them a reaction, it's like you played into their hand. Good. We're going to make you famous, though. I'm going to make you famous. That's why, in a but I'm just saying, I'm, like, I, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure there were people that saw this and said, yo, these fucking clowns here. Mm -hmm. But it's like the second I say something and share it, now I'm, giving, I'm putting light on you. Mm -hmm. The Negative scary, light, the scary part. That, it's, it's, it's a that juggle. Like troll it's a juggle. That is troll. You talking to an ex troll. Mm -hmm. I know what it means. Guess, I'm telling guess, you, the goal was to get motherfuckers upset and to get them talking. You know what? All that troll shit is cool until it's out of the metaverse. Yep. Yeah. Right. Yeah, until it's, it's real, it's real cool, world consequences. Cool there there are real life yes. ramifications yeah. for mm -hmm. your actions yes. in and out of real life. 100. So, so I'm with you. Hey, troll away. You're looking for a response? Cool. But you're going to get something in your world. But there's something that comes with that that you might not be prepared that for. That you wasn't planning for. The response. Mm -hmm. The real I, life response. I, fuck, mm -hmm. fuck everybody. Mm -hmm. Fuck you trending. Like you, niggas will, yo, them niggas I'm pretty sure was sitting there like, yo, look, we everybody talking about, yo, this person talking about us. They think they up until that ass whooping come. And they could. And then they tried to explain it and sounded even stupider. They tried to say, hey, these are our preferences. See, and we're allowed to have preferences the way you're allowed to have preferences. Pastor Rock, That's Joe. not a preference. Pastor Rock, Pastor Rock. Take it. <laughs> Shit on someone, isn't it? Uh, right. There you go. As a person with preferences, and that's something that I've learned, it's perfectly fine to have your preference. You're fucking right. Mm -hmm. You are entitled to what you like, mm -hmm. and there's nothing wrong with that. The problem comes with when you need to put someone else down True. to reinforce your preference. That's, 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 that's where the problem is. You can like whatever you want. Yo, I only like women from Camden, New Jersey. I don't no, know why did you go I said to like that. troll rehab? Nah, yeah. it's no, no, it's not. No, no, no. Troll, no, troll, 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 it's not troll rehab. You grew up. It's, it, it's growth. You grew up. You grow up. That's I'm why kidding, I, I'm kidding. Ice no, today no, no. and ice ten years ago, two different ices. Me no, today, he's actually kind of the same ice, up. but he was a troll online. I, I, online persona ice. Right. I totally disagree. He I'm was not. I'm not. I'm not who a vagina ten years ago in my house. Like I don't know about the trolling shit. I'm talking about who he was. He's never gonna let that I'm talking about who he was. Yeah, because me and Corey was coming from a show long. doing business <laughs> and got a phone call that said, "Yo, you know I used to stick in Hennessy bottles in so much vagina." I didn't put the Hennessy bottle up her. She her did. sister put it up her. Her sister did that. Yes, but that was me? that was your company though. Your company still something. You're responsible for the goods. <laughs> but no, it's not. I it's just not, a different man today. That's it's the point. not. Um, it's not troll rehab or nothing. It's just you grow up and you mm -hmm. realize, like, damn, that was some childish shit or some hurtful shit. Like, I don't want to hurt nobody. Or and ignorant. I, yeah, you just learn. Yeah, you you learn, and that's why it's like when I watch people today do this shit. It's like dogs. You've seen enough niggas make mistakes. You've seen enough. You you've seen what happens. You've see you see people on apology tours left and right. For shit that you know they didn't really mean that way, but you hurt somebody. Mm -hmm. So for y'all to do this today, no excuse. Can't roll with it. They did all that uh, under the guise of these are preferences and never told us what their preferences were. Hmm. It just seemed like the preference I, was I, I, anything that's not a black woman. that wasn't a black woman was their preference. Yeah, that's the preference. Anything See, that's not a black woman. That was their preference. And no, that's not. No, that's not but, a preference. And that's not a preference. That's not a, <laughs> that's not a preference. I agree with you. And these two idiots are too stupid to know that. And then I watch Act talk about it, and I learned 
the the, the main idiot. The, the I don't know none of these niggas' names. I don't want to learn. Yeah, it's it's supposedly like a ex federal agent or some shit. Really? Yes. He's a fed. He's a something. Because I kept talking about, well, he's really big on punctuality, and then she was late, and he's really militant, like he makes everybody take their shoes off when he comes to his house, like he's, that's who he is. So when she was late, and then she was interrupting, and she was talking over, I saw some people saying that she was being really rude in his house. I wouldn't give a fuck. So There's he, a way to let somebody know they're being rude in your house or get them out of your house without doing that, without doing what he did. See, but they play like that. They playing like that around these young kids. Around Asian, I don't know how old she is, mm. but the squad that be in there be a real young mm -hmm. kind of squad. Mm. Like I felt damn near culpable. Like it's too many podcasters that just go grab a mic, yep. and they just get to talking with their buddies. Don't have enough experience to support the views that they sitting here saying. Can't tell you why they feel like some shit. Hmm. Regurgitating some shit, don't know who they hurt and don't know who they offended, just vomited a mouth. Fam, it's it's literally just let me say whatever I could say or do whatever I could do. And that's to not get the podcasting. Numbers. And that's yo. not podcasting. But that and nobody and I'm, new, and I'm new to it, and I can tell you that's nobody not podcasting. Nobody would say it. Listen, if you didn't want to stick stand up for black women, nobody wanted to jump in and say, yo, dog, whatever you think you're doing, this ain't it. Like that's, that's not, not potting. It's not it. It's lazy. It's offensive. You just rambling. And who the fuck are you niggas? That was the other thing. Like, you niggas? No. 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 Because now, what time are we in? We already know that black women are the most degraded disrespect. We know that already. But when did it get to y'all two could do it? <laughs> nobody could That's do it. That's not politically correct. Nobody could do it. No, I know nobody I could it. do it. I, but it. I hope I'm not coming off like I think people could do it. No, 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 no. No one you can do it. You shouldn't do that. But you but two niggas, especially. That's funny. That's, y'all two yeah. should be the last two niggas to get on the mic. Y'all should have edited that, erased that. Y'all should have did something. And that's and, again. And some man needed to say, dog. Fam, that nah. lead, like I told y'all nah. a, a bunch of pods ago. Any of your The friends. lack of consequences with these young niggas today, they think they can just do that. Nobody's no, going to edit it. Nobody's going to edit it. You know why? It's In their mind, this is going to go out. Everybody's going to be talking about it. This person's going to get mad. That person's going to get mad. And that's where it's going to stop. There's no real life consequences to the bullshit. Well, that's why on this podcast... I try to talk about community and how we will handle things as a community. Uh -huh. Hey, if such and such is lying and, and we canceled this nigga's career, uh, what do we do as a community? Right. Hey, we got these, these two doofy right. niggas is, talk, is talking our our black black women this way. Wait, wait, wait. As a community, what are we doing? Yeah, there's no ramifications, no consequences for it for them. No, but what I, are we? No, I, I'm, what doing. I'm saying is the, too much re of that. the reason why they're so comfortable doing it is because they don't think nothing bad can come from it. Nothing that can affect their real life. Niggas is like, if you, as long as y'all are talking about me, hate me. Say I'm the worst nigga in the world. As long as y'all are talking about me, I won. That's how trolls think. Yo, I, I, think the, I, think not, I think the KKK used to be called the Night Riders or some shit. Like, nah, Knights of Columbus what? or some shit like that. Some shit. I've heard Wait, the Knights that of Columbus phrase, was the KKK? Something like that. I don't know. Don't I have heard Columbus. the phrase no, Night Riders. What happened? A lot of the motorcycle gangs and shit come from derivatives of yeah. the, the, the KKK and all them organizations, them anti-organizations. But what else did he say? The, 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 I don't I even want to repeat all that the shit he was saying. But yeah, I had to, Ice. No, no, no. no. I, as, I, a, as a black man, yeah. as a black man with I'm a black say, mom, I'm just as saying, a black man on, with, on, black on, the, on the side of black yeah, for me it didn't cousins, matter. Aunts. For me it didn't matter that I, women dog, might kill me I don't want or that somebody might say that I'm saying but, like what they did was okay. None of that No, we don't think you're saying that. I'm talking about the fans. People misinterpret everything. What I'm saying is Speaking as a person who used to troll, all you want is everybody talking about what you're trolling about. Mm -hmm. That's it. Till a nigga catch you in the airport, yes, punch you I'm, in the I'm, face. I'm with and, you this, and this be the thing with the trolls. This be the thing with the trolls. A lot of them trolls be corny niggas. Mm -hmm. One, they don't get no women. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Yeah. 
right? <laughs> they don't get no bread. Mm-hmm. They stay behind they the fucking computer screens computer in their houses in. and don't go outside. Damn, these niggas been living in the metaverse. You the corny nigga that don't go outside. So on so a, you could say a, whatever you want. You could disrespect people's family. You could disrespect people's whoever friends. you want. Because there's you no ain't real never world. been punched in your face yes. before. Yes. And when you get punched in your face, it changes. It shit. changes shit. Yep. Yeah. I'm with you. Yeah, it makes you, you look at yourself. I, I, again, I, I, and it makes I, podcasts look bad enough. I equate you. them to Karen, the Karens. Yeah. Right. Like you do that dumb shit until somebody punch you in your face. When you get punched in your face, you stop that shit. The lady spit on the lady uh, in the store and got her ass whipped, my yeah. nigga. Spitting on somebody. Spit on nobody else. Beat the dog shit out of her and deservedly so. I bet you. I bet you keep that saliva in your mouth next time. And so that's the same thing. Somebody mother run up on somebody son run. Yo, you said you bop. Stops it. I want to shout out to Agent Doll for how she handled that. No, she handled that. She smoked Amazing. that. She smoked that. And, and I'm not the biggest Agent Doll fan, but she I wasn't did either. that. The but way she kept her composure and everything. She yeah. So shouts to her. Cause that shout. had to be uncomfortable as fuck. But that's why that's really one of the reasons why I was mad. Like you doing that to her. On some bully shit. Bully, bully. On some bully shit. Again, he kept it. And she, wait, right? And and this woman, I don't know much about her, mm. but I know her from like King Von affiliations and just some of her other things outside of music. Like, th- she don't portray herself to be chump, is mm. what I'm saying. Right. And in that moment, she's trying to have a conversation saying, yo, you, you mean. Mm. Like, that's somebody saying, yo, you're not treating me well here. Yo, what you doing? All I'm telling you is, X, Y, Z, and how you responding to me, you mean, you being me. Even how you're handling me now, you being me. She said it. And he just kept on. Kept on. I wanted to jump through the phone like the Pump It Up video. Like in the <laughs> ring. I wanted to jump right through the screen. <laughs> For real, because you need, <clears throat> pardon me, back to uh, Meth putting his arm around me, taking that walk. You just need your OGs. You need older people to like, to OG. Mm-hmm. And that's where see I know Ack is not that Ack is is young and learning on the fly and doing an amazing job. Ack ain't about to sit nowhere and check you niggas. Now Grant, make Grant he wasn't there, <laughs> but I don't know if y'all do that in front of him. Even I don't know if you do that in front of him. Ack is 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 experienced enough. Not to for say, nothing. He's they OG. Yeah, but that's the problem. Not for nothing. That's part of the problem. Because he is their OG. They These niggas look up to him. I know. But and, but right. but when you look up to somebody, it's important to identify what you're looking up to and why. Act, I haven't heard him speak this way no. about women. I've never heard. About black women especially. Right. This was particularly flagrant mm-hmm. for me. So I've never heard that. But, and and but. Act ain't going to be the one to hear it and... Try to mentor these niggas. That got shit to do. He got a million jobs. He getting to it. But look, look, look. Or and they, Ak ain't gonna on, be on. the one to smack the shit out of one of these niggas in their home. But listen, they look up to Ak. They've seen Ak disrespect people, and what happened because of it. So they're. I ain't want to say that. That and they're. Uh, no, I'm start saying. Talking about. I was going. Well, shut look, up. And they're. And they're. And their eyes. eyes they're kind of following him. People think that. It, the whole, whoa, whoa, whoa. Even watching you, right? You are provocative. Watch an act. Act is provocative. Mm-hmm. So people feel like, yo, I can be provocative and, succeed, and it's going to catch and it's going to work. Right? All right. Well, let me throw let a me little hold, bridge. Go let, ahead. Me, let me take it a step further. When the kid, uh, what's the kid that was, was told, act, I should smack you? Vic Mensa. When he was on that show, he said, yo, you are talking about shit that affects our life. Niggas are dying in my neighborhood mm-hmm. and you making it a spectacle and you making it a joke as if it is something funny. It's not funny. The same way you outraged about how these dudes is talking about these women, other niggas was outraged at how Act talked about them kids dying. Yeah. You can be outraged. He wasn't going to put a hand on Act. I'm not, I'm not dis... He not there. He, he, he could have. He would have did that there. I'm just... You guess what I'm saying? I'm saying he had the... 
the 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 same potential outrage that you are having. So if Ak is your OG, and I'm not in no way, shape, or form blaming academics for these boys' message or these niggas' demeanor, what I'm saying is if that is your role model that you're following, I get your now point. I seen Joe say some outlandish shit, and he's the hottest nigga. Ak says outlandish shit, he's the hottest nigga. Let Let's think say, of something right, well, new. Well, then let me yeah. let me then let me let me advance I, the, let me advance this conversation then, because y'all are right. Let me explain to you how that happens. With both me and Ak, I'll use us as the examples. Cool. Mm-hmm. Him and I have a, an extensive enough credit line in what we've built and how we've built it and the audience that comes with it to where we maybe can make a mistake. They don't see that. Who's that? I'm talking about them, them two young niggas. They don't see that. Well, that's why I'm here to tell them to them. I'm here, I'm here to say now. I am uh, well enough tenured to make a few mistakes. And even in that, they can't be crazy mistakes. But look, it can't hold, on, get, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, I, I, I'm, like, uh, I'm not trying to talk from landing. But like you, you've said things about somebody and got punched in the face. True. You That's the part that they don't know is what I'm saying. You got to see like, yo, I can offend people and some real shit happened after the offense. Yeah. And you got to deal with it. And you have to, de- now what? You got to deal with what it. What do you do when you get ready to walk outside? Because you can find where anybody live. You know, how, them niggas that it showed up hard. at your house with the rocks, sent you it the address hard. and how how long? It ain't hard. Like, what do you do? You walking outside and boom, here comes some niggas now. And they got a problem with what you said. True. Now, it ain't the internet. Now, it ain't just jokes. It's real life and it's in your face. That was an amazing point that you made. You just step on my point and my make bad. Me forget my point. My fault. Excuse me. But my point was, You're talking they about don't you. have the credit line. Yeah. Right. They don't have the history. They don't have the rapport with community, culture, or audience to be able to make this type of mistake and just land on your feet. No, that shouldn't happen. That can't happen. And I'm kind of not even talking to them. I, I highlight this so black women know not to go up there. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Let let him do if that with niggas, some men. Them, no, no, no. Them niggas don't like y'all. Don't go up yeah, there. Don't, don't go, go up there as a there. guest. Don't go up there to sit around and take that show. That. Show them. Don't watch it. Yeah, shit. Smack show, the shit show, out of them niggas. Shut <laughs> y'all fucking doofy asses up. And that doofy, stupid ass, colorful table that's Timestamp killer. Hate all that shit. Time what? I don't want them to get no prep pub. No, bleep it. Yeah, yeah bleep the no name pub. for sure. We not fucking gall of these niggas. And that's all these niggas that want, man. Nasty, I'm, I'm telling you, I know for a niggas. fact these niggas are loving this right now. I you think? I doubt they, it. I don't think. No, 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 I don't think so. No, no, no. I don't think so. I, I think about. I, 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 I think y'all got trolls fucked up. Yeah, you got trolls. Because ain't no real life shit happened yet, so they're loving this. Correct. Them niggas is happy. Says who? You are trying to make money off of your platform. It's a difference when you the troll nigga on Twitter and you're not trying to monetize it. These niggas is trying to grow a business, and it has backfired. Yeah. You t- you trolling on Twitter? Even Ice, that. You trolling look, on Twitter? Ish. You are not monetizing it. It's a different ballgame. Ish, These niggas but start- even that, even that, everybody's sharing the video. Like you said, you wanted to go see something else that they did. That. So now niggas is going to watch their videos. Their numbers are still increasing. And it stops. Because of your content, it stops. You're pushing content. Right, yeah. That That's is going what you're, forward, yeah. That's have, what you're selling. You're pushing content. You're not sitting behind a Twitter desk using your fingers to keep getting more mm-hmm. motherfucking mm-hmm. excited and 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 uh, uh, uh and aroused. And that's these what these niggas are what trying to said. monetize this. Don't go up there. Everybody stop fucking with it. Yeah, Show this is back. Make them feel it. Make this them is feel it. And I don't know that too many people fuck with it in the first place. That yeah, might be some it. new shit. I, I don't know. know nothing about what them niggas. That could have been how they was trying. But to they're jump not going to keep so, doing that. So they was trying to jump out the window and be a young Kevin Samuels, and it is not going to work. You are backfiring, nigga. There you go. That's all I got. All right, we offer them that negative Nancy shit yeah. on yeah. the on the positive brother building, brotherhood building. <laughs> so, so me being the quote unquote builder, builder. of the yep. podcast. You are the <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Yeah. Finally, somebody now, another. Fi- finally, DeAndre Ayton caught the Chris Paul pass. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we, off mic, we were talking about a new legendary name of a New Jersey strip club called Jersey Girls. <laughs> Ice told us that they're... You guys are Jersey guys. 
Shut and up, and Parks. We, and we, and we did a <laughs> lot of Jersey girling, <laughs> but Man, I said Jersey they're building girl. another one, and I said, damn, that don't make sense because I've been trying to get niggas together for years to buy a strip club. Mm. And Joe says, yo, shut your fucking mouth. You always talking da, da, da. And I'm like, nigga, I haven't. And I said, yeah, he did. So Joe says, well, how much money do we need? What's the, what's the difference? Yeah, advance the conversation, not let's pool our shit together. What do we need? Why would I? got I? something toward that. Uh, uh, now, now you got something toward it. Yo, I'm the man at having something toward. I am no longer the man at having it. I ain't doing that no more. I'm not just so having it. But <laughs> having something hat. toward, like mm-hmm. other people yeah. there too, Pulling I'm together. down with that. All right, now watch what I call this dusty ass bluff. I want you to be right there, Corey. I'm going to call a bluff for you. All right, watch. I ain't said no more. It's take your red roof in money. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to add some pod money. Yeah, we got to get yeah. some more people. No, we don't. We don't, we don't. <laughs> It might not. Ice, I, might might not sneaker maybe not. I might bring some sneaker money. Maybe not. I might bring some sneaker money. I got some foot foot action. I'll bring a little sneaker money. But in I've there. been trying to tell I can people. EQ the club. Yo, somebody told me fifty bought privilege for thirty grand. Huh? Privilege is a strip club in New York for the that people that don't on know. Fire. They, they, like they're, fish they're, no, they're not there anymore. They're not. And if I wasn't afraid of fifty, I'd call them right now and ask them why <laughs> it's not there. <laughs> Yo, but I see he, when he I said bought, why it's not there. Um, he he's been saying what he said when he's off my gut. I'm Miss Privilege now. <laughs> That's my little Yo, spot. dog. But, but the crazy the part is, was, Privilege was the size of this room. Yes. Mm. And that shit was raining money. Yeah. So to all of my money getting friends, I've been trying to get them for years. Yo, we could jump in together and get this shit cracking. And everybody was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But we aren't experienced in this. So and b- when me you neither. say that, I've never owned a strip club we, in my life. I said we, so when you say that, that don't really tell somebody what they need and what needs to be done. I don't know what needs well, to be done. If enough we, people to say, all right, I'm with it, then he'll go find but out. But if everybody got the same objective and the same motive, now we sparking, yo, we can find a location. We can find what it takes and what it entails. You would be the one as a guy that purchases property. The real estate guy. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah. right. But what I'm saying is business is business. Right. So to learn a business, at one point, you didn't know podcast business. Yeah, we could at probably, one point. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. anything that you jump into, you got to kind of get your shit. Wet. We could probably do this without our money. Eat True. The tara. <laughs> <laughs> and somehow I still only see you twice a week. Like we could brother build. Like Joe, if, we, if we spend some time together, you and I. What I always told we used you, to spend time together prior you. to the pod, you. and I've had these ideas prior to the pod. Now I'm with your ass two days for a long two days every day. I don't want to see your fucking beard. <laughs> <laughs> we don't play Monopoly Niggas are scared of me I don't want to see y'all huh? beards You know what I'm saying? No I Run don't know back. what you're saying Yo, the last You was at the bottom of the list time stamp killer uh, Mark that when He said list. niggas are scared of him and Monopoly. <laughs> we, we know, I don't even know if we letting that fly <laughs> Bleep that out We gotta bleep that yes, out When Blast we hung out me. together before We didn't have the same resources that we have today That's not true Last year That's you true. were richer than you are now that's not true. Oh well, pardon me, big daddy. <laughs> you don't see the hat? That's, that's, yeah, right. Hey, the public said I was down. <laughs> I never said, "Yo, y'all right." <laughs> Yo, so again, I came in here saying I would make more money if I just did these things. <laughs> and, but you get what I'm saying? I've been saying this shit for a long time. Well, we should do it. All right, cool. But so Atlanta's got all our girls. I would hire now. No, you the man. You can get them over there. Yeah. You Wait. Oh, then I pull out this pool already. Hey, Look how fast hey, I no. pull out the pool. If <laughs> I'm responsible for bring, no, no, we hiring Frank. Don't be the A. What's wrong with you? Frank gonna get a big, big bag. Frank is the Don Dada, and nah, they gonna call Frank. We hire pretty Lou. We hire all these names. Yeah. There you go. And Frank, I'm hiring. I'm calling Frank. Pretty That's Lou. It. I gave Pretty Lou the biggest hug in the world. Um, uh, uh, when I seen him in Star Wars about two weeks ago. If you're not familiar, Pretty Lou. Uh, beat cancer, uh, New York City staple. If you've been out, so I, I seen him. We locked eyes in the strip club. He heard the pod. He DM'd me about it. So when he when we seen each other, uh, I gave him the biggest hug in the world. Surrounded by all that ass. Round of applause again for Pretty Lou. <laughs> Seriously, man. Oh, yeah. Seriously, he looks so happy to be doing what he does, and I was so happy to see him. <laughs> nah, and he enjoy it. Yeah, like he be up there having a ball. He like does. he enjoys it. He's dope. Hey man, speaking of uh, uh, legends and and, and beating oh, things, or whatever, right. we want to definitely put our prayers up for K. Slay and yeah. be battling COVID. Oh my and, god, and, and Kid Capri, yeah. and Kid Capri. Yeah. I see. I didn't even know that. Yes, definitely. Kid Capri and K. Slay. Yeah. Prayers up for both them brothers, man. Those are legend, legend, legends. legends. Yeah. It don't get much higher. 
Yeah, it's hard to get higher than them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he said Slayer's on a ventilator. Yeah, yeah. just got it's on a ventilator. I did read fight. reports that he's doing better today. Said they've been fighting nice. for two weeks. Nice. Thank God. Yeah. yeah. Yo, yeah, we got both of y'all in our prayers, man. Yeah, yeah, we're praying for K Slay, DJ K Slay, and DJ Kid Capri. Our guys, our guys. Mm-hmm. What's do we know what what uh, what's wrong with Kid Capri? COVID, COVID, I believe as well. Yeah. It's COVID. Well, I do don't we, know if it's a serious. Uh, do we have a I don't know. Yeah, I don't know yeah, about Kid Capri's was a couple weeks ago. I thought he was over it by he, now. I don't know. I just seen but, people tweeting that he was also fighting COVID. Yeah, he was. I don't a know weeks the severity. Ago, I don't know nothing. They said K Slade just got put yeah, on a ventilator, put on a ventilator in the last couple of days, couple of days mm-hmm. and he's been fighting it for two weeks so far. Well, we got the easiest job in the world, which is to pray for those brothers. Word. Word. That's real. We don't have to know. So shout out to Kid Capri and DJ K Slade. True Um, anything else that we need to get? Two need to this Kanye Julia Fox shit out there, but we don't have to get to that here. He's a little doofy. Yeah, he is. It's doofy. Yeah, he's doing he's doing the same shit that we uh, killed that I killed kid. her for. Yeah. yeah, worse. Why you say that? Why worse? Because it's retaliatory. Retaliatory? <sighs> no, because of the way. Like, and it is retaliatory. It, it could be, but it seems that way. It looks the way that they're doing it, like. I yeah. hate talking shoots. about these niggas, but <laughs> Kim Kardashian going out to eat. I was trying not. Yeah, Kim Kardashian going out to eat and the paparazzi catching them coming out of a restaurant is not the same as you being in the walk-in with the chick laying She's on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. She hired paparazzi. I was just going to say, hold on, it's, we can't, she can't do that. Paparazzi. Listen, high, even, yeah, even if that's she, not paparazzi catching you. That's, yeah. Even if we she hired you. paparazzi, even if Pete Davidson hired paparazzi, I'm coming out of a restaurant and they taking pictures of me. Cool. So let's say they did hire them. You purposely having a photo shoot in the middle of your walk-in closet is a totally different ballgame. And releasing the pictures. I disagree, but I won't argue with you because they're doing the same shit. Yeah, they're doing the same thing. I disagree. I only disagree. Well, this is why I agree. Fuck why I disagree. I agree with you. This is a little worse. Because no matter what I say about Kim and Pete and who they're hiring and what they're doing, she might like him. (laughs) Mm -hmm. She might. It's not my place to say whether she do or don't. But in all of this other stuff that I be throwing out there, the fact remains, she could like him. All she's been saying when addressing Kanye is, yeah, you rich and we doing all this shit, but I miss the little things. I want to watch a Netflix movie with somebody. Mm -hmm. I want a hug. I want somebody to hold my hand. So when you see her and Pete doing all this bullshit. See how it comes around? She could like him. See how it comes around? Kanye, on the other hand. I said that earlier. Knock it off. You don't like this girl. And no. And you just being you she, just being spiteful. She might fall in the pog category, which seems to be no. his thing. And as the man. You just had a 22-year-old white this. girl in your house. You can't do it as the man. The women can do whatever the fuck they want to do. When you start being the woman, you look mm-hmm. stupid. Full circle, mm-hmm. full circle, full circle. Yo, women can say mad shit about us. We can't say it back. You can't. It and, could be untrue. And, they could say a bunch of shit about you that's untrue. And you know what? That's another When you get on too. TV and start telling the truth, you look like a bitch. Uh, uh, Unfortunately. With a cup. With a cup. With a cup. Oh, man. Nah. Uh, he gonna put a dollar in the cup right now. <laughs> Jazz up the cup, please. Corey. Because you said it. <laughs> and Joe hasn't. Yo, so mm. again, you look... You know what I mean? Like, like you a look what? Goofy. <laughs> 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 but the, see how the circle came right back around? But you Kim, know the Kim Kardashian's filthy rich. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. Kim Kardashian, filthy rich. Mm-hmm. She said, "Yo, I just want a nigga to make me laugh. I want a hug. I want to mm-hmm. do normal people shit. I don't need a nigga that got as much money as me to be fucking happy. Mm-hmm. Cause she can't find a nigga that got much money as her. Damn near. I want the small things because financially, I'm straight. Your provision now don't gotta come in in the form of finances. It gotta come in the form of jokes, laughs, dick." You, you get what I'm saying? Like yeah, other shit. Else. Everything Pete, else. Yeah. Pete, Pete ain't broke, though. Be he clear. ain't got her money. No, of course not. Oh, oh he okay. ain't money. No, well, be the fuck not. clear. He ain't got that. No. So, he probably he well off. compared to both of them. He's broke compared to them. So, it's nothing he could do for her financially she no, can't do can for be, herself. He can be funny. He can be funny. And he can be charming. It can and be he can be smart. Affectionate. And a whole bunch of there. other shit. Yes, yeah. he can do the foot massages and all that other shit. My thing with Kanye and why it looks corny for him, and it really does, it looks corny for them both, I think, when they orchestrate that way but more so for him y'all went on a date and six days later there's an interview about the date a whole synopsis you inter- of the somebody date. interviewed julia fox about the date y'all went on she can't give nothing concrete she in the interview saying well we don't know where this is going but if things continue this way then 
I'm going to enjoy the ride. Well, I bet you are. And you never release that without his okay. And then you get the hotel room and fill it up with clothes like we've seen you do for at least two other women. Did he? He did it for Kim. Mm-hmm. Now, I won't count that because that's your wife. That's your wife. But that's his little move. That's a nice move. And it's a nice move. <laughs> say, it works. A nice move. See, now the women will say, the women will say, I don't know why you're doing anything for me that you that you did for a nice girl. <laughs> the right but, shit in there, they're going to say, gonna shut up. Shit, some of that shit worked. The right shit, they're going to shut up. Yeah. You start getting out of town. What shit, woman is not up. gonna love the hotel room full of clothes from the billionaire who is showing interest? I seen what happened That's when true. Carrie when Carrie was looking for an apartment with Mr. Biggs. Have you been watching this shit? No, but I what? seen what, what that nigga so did with that. He told her, <laughs> "Yo, I got the closet. But, uh, the don't worry section, about it." Oh, no, I don't watch the. I'm, no, I'm, I'm talking about the old stuff. Yeah, I know, I know. It's classic sex in the just, city. It's terrible. It's when bad. toward the end, she was looking for an apartment. And he Biggs wasn't Mr. Big wasn't trying to. She looked at some bunch of shit that she could afford, or just that with low little closets, tiny closets. And Mr. Big found some shit with the biggest closet in the world. Mm-hmm, that's not what happened. What happened? He said the closet was whack. He said, "Don't worry about it. I got it. I'll take care of it." Yeah. And she said, "He oh. took care of it." He said, "Okay." And the next he time she came it. back, that closet looked like a studio in, in Brooklyn, mm-hmm. and she was like. Oh. It made our whole life. Women like shit like what, that. The small it, shit. Women yo, like I to pay yo, attention yo, to yo, them. Exactly. I've seen no. But what they fuck zero pay, in on what they. But fuck want. paying attention to them because that still puts it back on what men think of what they're doing. I'm just talking about the things that bring women joy, mm-hmm. like a walk-in closet, like uh. But if and, uh, in, the lower scale of that, you gotta be, know that that's flowers. something that's that what she, she likes. Can y'all let me finish Go my point on. on a lower scale of that? Because you're right. Everybody don't do that. But I've seen the happiness that chicks get when you buy them the right little makeup desk. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. With the nice little cute bench. Yeah. yeah. On the lower scale of that. Huh? Whatever dumb little... Yo, one of my exes was a sock head. So stupid... I see why you left her. <laughs> nah, he's, chick chick, nah, chick nah, running around collecting nah, socks. Nah, that's that's little guy that's in the feet. He, he, he loves huh? feet. No. Yeah, she, she covering, them, she covering up them feet. Dumb, dumb shit like that. <laughs> Right. Where like my my girl likes flowers, uh-huh. so flowers is her thing. It's fucking twenty dollars. Twenty twenty two. I'm not having a flower argument no more. I'm not doing it. They yeah. tried. They tried me the the whole twenty twenty one. That's what they do to niggas with a couple dollars. They bring it back to the old shit that mattered, like flowers. No, I'm not doing it no more. I'm lost. What you mean? When you get a woman everything in the universe, and then she try to bring it back. Oh, I just want the little things. I want flowers. Why didn't ever send me flowers? Like, for all the things you do, you got flowers. Come to my door every week. You know my address. Like, I really love flowers. And you know I love them. So why don't you? That is what I'm talking about. I ain't having that fight no more. Now, now hold on. Nope. Hold on. Hold on. Sorry. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Real Sorry, quick. buddy. Joe. Hey, just... me too, bitch. Buy me some. But listen. <laughs> that kind of goes in. What the fuck is you talking about? That about? goes into what we was just saying. I got another one coming. Let me. You going to prepay. No, I'm going to treat this like the waters at the gym. I get them niggas about $30. I'm going to keep coming back for waters. So I'm going to put two more in there. I got two more coming. But look, that goes back to what we were saying. Like, Fucking you could be doing, the, you may be giving her the world. Flowers is what matter to her. Now, to the next chick, she don't give a fuck about the flowers. She wants Chanel. Yeah. Like I don't buy you, flowers. I'm allergic to them. But if that's I like what, flowers too, buy that, me some. But if that's what's her shit, then the next nigga can get her just by getting her flowers. Go take a bag of my shit. Buy me some. I'm Fuck telling you. Talking about. No, he might be right. Fam. He might it, be right. it comes with knowing your nice girl, right. knowing the girl. Everybody got their own. That's true. And that goes 360 back shit. to the proposal it, argument we had. And, I, and, and the one that I walked back and yeah. said, I'm wrong, I stand corrected. I definitely said I stand corrected. I was on one side of the fence on the proposal thing, mm-hmm. and I and I backtracked and said, "Yep, it ain't me. It's, it's about what they want on mm-hmm. their particular day, oh, and what would make them happy." I was wrong. So same thing goes to this. You you was on that side too. I'm still on that side. I'm talking about Joe. Oh. Joe was on that side of the fence. So again, it's about them and yeah, what makes about them happy, her. dog. That's it. If once you commit to a chick, it, it's about them. It's about y'all. Yeah. She's supposed to find out what makes you tick. Exactly. You're supposed to find out what yep. makes her tick. Because the shoe's on the that. other foot. If you, you like would... massages and your girl, your girl's supposed to massage you. Mm-hmm. If your girl likes... I wish they could massage us and it not lead to sex, though. No, it don't have to. <laughs> it don't. Why, when I ask for a massage, it can't just be that? <laughs> That's what they say to you? I say it, too, sometimes. 
Like, if I'm asking you to scratch this spot on my back, like, stop working your way down to my dick. <laughs> like, my back really itched. <laughs> All right, she took care of the itch. Man, she got an itch, too. Listen, y'all become compliant with a, a woman's sex drive if you want. I'm not. Oh, no, it's no. not possible. No, no. Oh, I'm okay. not fucking that. You possible. got me fucked up. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, you, two, you talking like Captain Captain Dick? No sir, no sir. Uh, Why no, you? I, I, nigga, I bought the rules. I am a private. <laughs> I bought the rules. You got me fucked up. <laughs> I am a new recruit. I am not. Yo, dog. Girl sex drive be different. I'm keep good. that shit. I wish they keep it to themselves. Like I don't need to. They fuck supposed to they, tell us, they, but they, they, they no, 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 no. Don't tell me. No, we don't want to fuck. I don't want to know. We want to fuck. We don't. I, I need a headache. They I crazy. got a headache. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. I'll be praying she she fell asleep and forgot. They don't care about your headache. <laughs> no. you, you don't even have to do anything. No, 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 no. You know what cures a headache, right? Like, no, no, I don't need that. So does this Tylenol. <laughs> PM. Tylenol. Yeah, yeah, because now I'm sleepy. <laughs> like, I got to work in the morning. Oh, man. Fuck. For real, you complain about me fucking falling asleep during the shows, but you suck my dick during... You forget it. <laughs> like, <laughs> be accountable. Yeah. This guy is crazy. You think I'm just sleepy? <laughs> no. <laughs> my energy's gone, nigga. Yeah, you fucking mm-hmm. watch my spirit fly out of my fucking <laughs> body, and now you want me to stay up for Hightown? No. no I no. started that, by the way. I didn't start it yet, but they've been. They've been uh, Hightown's pretty good. I'm only like three episodes deep, so I'm not that far. Oh, see, don't fucking with us. Oh, if too. you think it's good, <laughs> three episodes. Oh, no, you got turns it. up? You oh, yeah. Ride. Oh, How many nice. seasons have Two. 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 First, first yeah, okay. uh, season is eight episodes, it's... and the second season is ten. I, I gotta say, I'm a little worried about um, Yellow Jackets. I'm worried. I still have lost trauma. <laughs> that is gonna be some bullshit. I have lost trauma. Yeah, I see that. But they didn't eat nobody in Lost. Yeah, they was there for seven, eight, but nine the years. Didn't want and, them to leave. Yeah, it was, was bullshit. And, uh, I'm seeing. Have this. we ever seen a show where they made it off the island that they was trapped on? Gilligan and them never made it. <laughs> yes, they did. Ish Pull it up. The, oh, Ish Screaming's not here. Ish would know. Ish the 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 he would <laughs> <laughs> Who made it off Gilligan Island? <laughs> they made it off. At the Yo, you're the only one he, the saw only that person episode. That knows <laughs> how they made it off. Ish. Yeah, now I gotta know. A big boat came. You a big boat. Man. <laughs> I'm the fucking. king yacht. <laughs> <laughs> a big boat. All of them? Yo, go ahead. Never no, mind. seriously. I, I want to know. know. I think so. Did, did any know. of them eat each other? No, oh. never. But yeah, Yellow Jackets uh, is good. But uh, uh, what's her name? Marianne might have got eight. Mm. <laughs> Marianne was all right back in the day. <laughs> no, I eat Marianne now. <laughs> <laughs> For a whole day. Marianne. She was fine. I don't know why everybody was talking about the little blonde girl. <laughs> oh, oh man. Marianne got eight. Fool. Gilligan. Did they make it off Lost? Uh, I never bullshit, watched Lost. It was some <laughs> supreme bullshit. And I, I was late. I watched Lost like two years ago. Mm. Damn. Yeah, I was super late. I'm thinking about starting Grey's Anatomy next. Never seen that. Ever in your life? Oh, that'll be a nice 25 season <laughs> run. <laughs> right. yeah, right. hey. Hey. Buckle up. Pack a lunch, nigga. <laughs> oh, old, Grey's, old Grey's is dope. This new shit. I, I was know. just look, like looking at the old shows that I've seen people rave about that I'd never seen, so I said I'm gonna go back and watch. Something. I still got to saw watch. Heroes. Heroes was dope so for check two that seasons, but then it falls off. But I think it's only like the four. one I keep trying to watch that I've never seen is Mr. Robot. Oh, Mr. Oh, Mr. Robot is the shit. Yeah, it's and the shit. I would watch it if I could stop dealing with women. <laughs> <laughs> like that ain't the one. Yeah, you see what this little Mr. Robot <laughs> nah, shit it's is. Not, like. it's not they don't. Yeah, be, no, it's they not don't that. be into it. And I would you and But I want to watch it. It's good. Yeah, you you would probably like Mr. I'm gonna watch it. I am gonna watch it, Mr. Robot. No question. I'm caught up on Mayor Kingstown. The Mayor Kingstown finale is this week. Yes, sir. And is it um, is it multi season or is it one season? Like a there'll sh- be another. Season. There'll be another. No, there's going to be another. Because Yellow Jackets got renewed. That's what makes me worried about it being bullshit. Law. I hope they don't go that way. I think they are. I read it too. They said they had a five season plan for Yellow Jacket. Correct. I could see that being me. Feasible. I don't see them being the story is dope enough for them to continue it uh with a few more seasons, right? Um sometimes these type of shows that's what happened with Lost. They dragged it and it's like now you're trying to figure shit out to do to make it to season six or seven or whatever. I didn't watch it. Lost, but when they said that the the they started time the planet traveling turned all types. apart or something. Yeah, I was yeah, like, yeah, 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 bro, Lost weird. got weird. I hear you used to love that shit. I heard some people I like Lost. Lost was phenomenal. I like Lost a lot. Several had, seasons. Yeah, Lost was the best show on TV for a little while. Yeah. Um, I hear the same thing that you're saying about Yellow Jackets. People are saying about uh, Your Honor. 
There are some people worried about season two of Your Honor. Is there going to be season yes. two? Yes. Yeah. And it wasn't supposed oh, no. I'm worried and about season two. And there should be. See, I don't understand the people that say, oh, that should have just ended. I thought it was. Really there has serious. to be a season two of Your Honor. We why? have to. Why? What? Everything tied up. What, no. what else we got to do? No, it didn't. We ain't done here. Are you kidding me? Well, I, well, we're not done here, is all okay. I'm saying. I didn't know they renewed that. They ended that show with beef. That show ended with beef. With the gang, with the gang, uh, yeah, gangster yeah, dude yeah, yeah, finding yeah. out yeah. what he needed to find right. out. He know what's the, up the, now. The, the judge never saw no fucking retribution. Like. Yeah, let me ask you a question. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. If For Life was about white people, you think it got picked up again? No, I still think For Life is gonna get picked up somewhere. It did get. Picked it is up gonna get picked oh, up did? somewhere. I, IMDb picked it up. Just not oh, on streaming. ABC. I think if it was about white people, that got picked up. It would be Prison Break, right? Mm. Which did a bunch of seasons. It wouldn't be Prison not Break. Not that many. Because For Life was very no, well written. It's not written. the same. Concept, but I mean, but for white people in prison. Yeah, yeah. For yeah. Life was very well written. I think it... Uh, it was. Is. It was... Uh, it wasn't predictable. I just think that they... It was, anybody care about the thing. I'm preparing to get angry at the finale of Mayor Kingstown because... They not gonna tie everything up. They can't. For me. They can't. Not they, a one episode. It's impossible. It's impossible. Not a one episode. No way. It's impossible. Mm-mm. I knew they was gonna take that jail over in a heartbeat. It didn't take them long to do it either. <laughs> that was fake though. What was fake? Well, it's a TV show. Yeah, you can't. You ain't taking over with no jail like that. It's it's a, we, yeah, my man. He's look. talking about the TV show. I know, but no, that was cool. <laughs> we know they're fake. Yeah. <laughs> But, our jail uh, expert there. <laughs> our, is our jail, yeah, he's our jail analyst there. over here. You're lucky they let you live in Rikers, nigga. You're, you're, lucky, right. you're lucky you just saw the exit. Look, you're right. I'm glad they never put me in none of them jails where the, you was in, just, you slept in gin pot. Like, I always had my own cell. Like, all of that, I got to sleep with 70 of you niggas. That don't sound You cool. weren't sleeping by yourself in the bullpen. The bullpen don't count. Oh yeah, well I was. I'm going in my bed in a minute, man. Get my sheets and my little jumpsuit when I get out of here. I'm talking about when I leave the bullpen. <laughs> now, yeah. now we go into the joint where 70 niggas are sleeping in here. I, I ain't had to do that. One of these niggas ain't gonna like Joe Button. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it, yo, we'll just start some shit with you for no reason. Of course. Like people don't understand when they be laughing because you only stay in there three days. Nigga, three days could have turned into 30 years. You could have went in there for a parking ticket, nigga, and caught a body in that bitch and been gone till November. Uh, put the uh, cup, please. Please put a dollar in our <laughs> That in wasn't our about cup. women. No, 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 no. No one said that, rule. sir. No one said no. that, sir. I was going to let you slide. But no, I'm not. No, 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 no. We got a strict rule. Damn, I'm There we go. Piggity is my nigga, see? All right, there we go. Asshole. Somebody going to get rich off that cup. We didn't think about what we're going to do What that's going to? What club? It's going to go to my fucking Mega Millions jackpot that I keep trying to hit. won't go to your Mega I keep trying to hit it. You won't go to Mega Monopoly. You won't take that spanky. You go to a charity of our choice. Bitches. Fold fold one of the dollars already up one. Fold fold the dollar. I got one in the tuck. I still got one I could get out there. What? Come on. Damn me. Damn me. Make me do it. Uh, I don't think it's nothing else I have to get to. I don't. Happy 500. Happy 500. Happy 500 again, man. That's a testament, dog. I remember I was here for like, what was it, episode 90 something? Now to come back. Me too. I was there for like 72. <laughs> nice little run. Never been on a fucking show. <laughs> nah, I was on the show. I know. I, said, I, I was joking. I've never oh, been on the show. Nah, I, say, I sat up there. Joey's like, yo, come on my Hated show. Hated that yo. shit. Why you come on my show? 500 okay. episodes is a lot Damn, of episodes. That's a testament, it, It's a long time. And with that, just comes a lot of lessons, a lot of history, a lot of experience. Just shit you need to know to continue. So I'm grateful for it. Uh, I want to thank the fans. I want to thank everybody that played a part in the journey all the way through from beginning to end. I appreciate you guys and couldn't have done it without y'all. Um, and you you never really stop to celebrate or appreciate these moments because every day you get into it, mm-hmm. right? Like, so we stop and to acknowledge 500 episodes, but the plan is 500 more, 1,000 more, and you just go until the wheels fall off. But this is big. This is big. Uh and if you podcast out there, you kind of understand how big it is to be able to get to one of these monumental type of episodes. So I'm just grateful. I appreciate it. 
Um, and I'll try to show you my gratitude by having a kick-ass year this year um, in terms of pod. And so, again, thank you guys. We love y'all. We appreciate you. We couldn't have done this without you. And that's all I have for mushiness. <laughs> that's good mush. Enough mush. Good mush. Yeah, that's good mush. Enough mush. Not too much on the mush. Um, I want to thank y'all for listening. Keep us your... Yo, that one hurt. <laughs> nah, that one hurt. Nah, that one hurt. And it changed the game. Yeah, it did. And I was trying to buy X-Files for like... Nah. Couldn't, buy, couldn't, couldn't be in it after that. Oh, I see why you played this. Bucket low like fuck it, though. Oh, I see what you did. I see you you relate in the hole. I got it. Hell yeah, I'm fronting, but you love it. <laughs> <laughs> yo, we should never play over again. Everything this nigga says is funny, yo. What year did this come out? Like the real year, not the when he put on the album. It was a long time ago. It was a while ago. <laughs> These niggas are paying taxes. These niggas hustling backwards. <laughs> Yo, keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there until the next time. I bid you. These is a visu. <laughs> you know the rest. A big bucket of frozen water on my chest. Lord knows we need to be there until the next time. We bid you adieu. Farewell. Adios. Arrivederci. Hasta la vista. So long. Goodbye. Do remember life is a series of moments and moments pass. So let's make this one last as if it's all that we had. And lastly, the baddies are insecure, the stagnant women want to travel more, and the closed-minded women want you to teach them things. Grab an ibuprofen and enjoy your headache. I'll show you how to do this, Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Dang cars. Oh, we got to do a little toast for the 500, too. Yeah, let's toast it up. Po- we ain't poured I chunk all my lemonade already. <laughs> Hold a cup, dude. Yeah, just hold a cup. Put Cups up. Cup in the air. Cup in the air. Cup 500, in the air. 500, man. 500 more. 500 to 500 more. Thank you, gentlemen. I appreciate y'all. Thank you, listeners. Thank you for everyone that has been a part of this journey. And most importantly, thank you to the listeners out there. Here's a cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Cheers. Look me in the eyes. Look me in the eyes. <laughs> look me in the eyes. When we tears, though, because it doesn't count. If we don't look in the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I don't like yeah. when we started getting political with the cheers. You know what I'm saying? Can we just toast and keep it moving? <laughs> My niggas here. Yeah. Heavy handed. Yeah, you know. It was one of the, it was it was the bottom of the bottle again. What are we supposed to do? It's always the bottom once you get it. We're gonna <laughs> celebrate tonight for real at uh, Atlantis. <laughs> the official 500 party. <laughs> Rap about it now. Hope you get it later. Yeah, Yo, he right. just makes everybody seem like a peon. Cause they usually are PR. <laughs> like seriously, even if you get money here, make you feel like a buzzard. <laughs> yeah. I ain't tell you, I pushed a six when the five was up. Mm-hmm. You got your little five. You want to just you go park like in the so. garage? <laughs> nah, let me put this five. This up. Bullshit. Fellow Potters, don't be doofs, please, yo, what? please. Somehow I feel like it's a poor reflection on me. I feel you though. Doofs, nasty fucking doofs. Black women, we love you. We love you. And stay away from the fucking deuce, yo. Be around niggas that know how to host you, love you, like you, make you feel comfortable, make you feel warm, special, accepted. We don't need to go on these off-site platforms with no views, no subscribers. They ain't helping you. It ain't helping you. And it ain't helping them. They just too stupid to know it. Mm Mm-hmm. And we going, y'all hold it down till next time, which is Wednesday, same time, same place. Work ethic crazy. <laughs>